throughout this time. I, I, that's like why I, I, I'm always afraid to like have an interracial relationship because I feel so guilty making them call me master when I get when I like spank them. Yeah, I wouldn't feel too bad about that. Like, I, it's, it's just some good. My, 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 music my, my erection is not nearly as strong as my white guilt. Um, <laughs> all right, guys, welcome to uh, Murder Hobo. Uh, Sorry, we're a one shot this evening. Uh, Frank has stepped out. Right, I am uh, filling in again for the night. Uh, we're here to play some D and D. Follow us on Twitch. Follow us on Twitter. Uh, we got some swag. Carol's wearing some swag. Show, show it off. Show it off. Oh yeah. Uh, yes. Put 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 them on the glass, honey. What? Put them on the glass. Let me put it on the glass. It's on the glass. <laughs> there we go. It's on. That's there. Uh, URL for that's below me. Uh, but uh, we're going to go around and introduce ourselves. Who they're going to be playing? Then I'm going to give you some background on where we're picking up at. So I'm going to start. Uh, Above me and to the left, I'm going to start with Matt, uh, oh. newbie for the group. Hi, I'm Matt. Um, I'll be playing Dizeld, who is a silver dragonborn wizard. Um, I think that's all I say. Is, do I say more? Uh, what What do you do in normal life? As much as you feel like divulging, not uh, you know, don't want the stalkers or anything like that. <laughs> uh, I'm a supplemental instructor at a uh, college, so I help tutor with uh, accounting. Oh, fun! Oh, cool. Very cool. Numbers. Yeah. Okay. Uh, below him, we have Scott, another returning face, who is surprisingly not playing Eric Hall. I know. No, I'm not playing Eric Hall. Uh, in celebration of Netflix releasing The Wizard, uh, the, uh, the, um, the Witcher, I am playing a bard. I'm playing um, Dandelion, which if you watch Netflix, The Wizard is, is actually Daskier, which is the... Anyway. Yeah, I'm playing a bard. And in real life, um, I do this, uh, and I go back and forth between uh, between Mexico and the United States, uh, and I uh, try to write modules and DM whenever I can. And and uh, who who what's your bard's name? Uh, Dandelion. Okay, yeah, hippie. Uh, up next, we got Carol. <laughs> Hi. What? Uh, who are you? What do you do? Uh, what's, who's your daddy? Is he rich like me? I, well, unfortunately, my dad is gone. <laughs> um, but he was awesome. And no, we weren't rich, but we were happy. Um, but hi, my name is Carol. I don't want to get, well, actually, you know, considering I'm playing my grave cleric, or should I call her the goth grave cleric known as Rain Bathory. Uh, maybe I do need to get a little depressed because that's what she is. Uh, but um, also, I am a longtime gamer uh, and miniature painter. And hey, yeah, you know, since we since we brought up reality, uh, like real jobs, actually, I'm a graphic designer. So, and I've been doing the same thing for 25 years. Do you, so uh, that, draw, ten do you draw tentacle porn for commissions? No, I don't. No, I actually do highly technical. Uh, highly technical stuff for um also, I've seen some very <laughs> intricate tentacle porn. Nothing nothing too hanky. I do occasionally get to see, you know, because of medical applications. There's some naked people drawing in a couple of my things, but not much. Most of it's pretty boring. But I like the job. All right. If next. you love what you if you love what you do, you never work a day in your life. Exactly. All right. Below her, finally last and uh, certainly not least, we have Ernest. Yeah, let's just say it, last but least. Um, so <laughs> I'm Captain Sugarbeard today. Uh, I don't really want to tell you too many details about my real life, um, but my character is um, a half-orc um, sailor who uh, is obviously a pirate and, um, you know, can't turn down any free food. <laughs> All right. Okay, so... Uh, for those of you that watch our Tuesday show, uh, Between the Rolls, uh, this was this scenario was created using one of our uh, uh, adventure creation uh, scenarios uh, made ex exclusively via random tables. So I'm actually, I, I was so impressed with what I did that I'm like, oh, fuck it, I'll run it. That sounds pretty cool. So these guys are in for a treat. <laughs> uh, they are picking up 
Uh, they were uh, recently commissioned by a Mr. Humbert Snorg uh, to uh, go out and acquire some uh, uh, very, very uh, expensive and uh, important plant material from uh, the nearby woods. And they are in a hurry to get it back to him as it is about to, uh, uh, it decomposes very quickly. So uh, we pick up with them arriving back in town, uh, ready to go turn it in and get paid. So uh, go ahead and take it away. Okay. Uh, I'm leader Rain. I'm the leader? Or what? You are uh, just you're you're familiar you enough. We are familiar enough with the layout of this town, having right. been commissioned out of it, that you would know essentially where to go. Oh well, yeah, I would go to get paid. Okay, so you're going to go to Humbert's shop. To get paid. So I, can I will follow. Alcohol. Uh, so I will follow as well, okay. strumming is along. Is that correct? Is that you're going to Humbert's shop? We are going to be. Yeah, paid. wherever wherever it was, we had to get. That, that, that's where you. That's where you had met with him prior. Okay. So we go to his shop and oh, you do not have uh it is locked. It is securely locked. Uh there is no one inside. There is a note uh, affixed to the door, seems to have been there for a day or so. Uh it says that uh, uh him and his family uh can be found at the temple across the street and would implore anyone with an emergency business to go contact him there. Okay, well, since we're on a time, you know, tough uh, a time schedule here uh, to get this before it degrades, I guess we better, as much as I don't like to, you know, disturb somebody in mourning, he really wanted this or needed this, and I think we should go. So, all right, guys, he's not here. We got to go. He's lost. It said that he lost his daughter, right? Uh, not yet. Do we know not that? Yet. Okay, sorry. I'm sorry, I saw read the briefing, so. Yeah. Um, so, uh, across the street. So, yeah. we turn around, or I at least turn around and start heading over and tell them, hey, look at this note. Okay. Uh, as, you, as you're approaching the building, uh, anyone that's proficient in religion can give me a check. Sure. I am. I'm pretty sure I am. Am I there? I, I, I'm assuming you were following behind the rest of them. You were, yeah. you were, yeah, okay. Okay. Rain, Rain did you read all that because my character can't read. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just Plus, wondering. I assume you, I, I, I mentioned, I say it out loud to you anyways. Uh, oh, Thank about, you. about the religion. Because my religion check was really high. It was 25. Okay, you will recognize that this is the temple to the wisdom, the god of decay. Oh, that's even oh, more okay. depressing than Kellenvor. Yeah, kind of the enemy of my god. Not really. No, 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 no. Certain rotten things taste delicious, impeccable. Mm. Yeah, yeah. It's called fermentation, and it's amazing. Yes, yes it's how beer works. That's true. Uh, you, uh, it, it's it's a very ominous looking structure. Uh, uh, a lot of lot of metal. Uh, any any wood that's in there is fairly old and decrepit, but. Uh, it's it's an open door. Uh, you can walk in. You could fairly recognize Humbert, uh, and he is uh, essentially sitting Shiva. Is what it, is what you would uh, interpret this. Thing. Okay, um, I assume I'll approach. I assume everyone else does as well. Yes, I do. I'll um, pull out my lute and start humming uh, like a, an appropriate funeral dirge. You know, like a requiem. Yeah, this place is just... Uh, give me a performance check. Okay. Uh, that will be a modified 25. The uh, uh, Humbert nods... Uh, 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 oh, what the hell's the word I'm looking for? Uh, uh, really? he's, he's, he's pleased with you. He, 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 he appreciates Approvingly. You. Yeah, yeah, for proving. Okay. Thank you. Gosh, dang it. It's okay. It's okay. It happens to all of us. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, he he, he nods approvingly. Uh, the uh, uh, actually, you go ahead and uh, the priests, uh, the high priest actually goes and uh, gives you five gold and says, uh, 
uh, if you wouldn't mind going for a couple more, uh, I would appreciate sure. that. Sure. Yeah. sure. I'll uh, I'll uh, take a position. Uh, kind as a, of as a chamber musician. Yeah, as as a chamber musician in the back and uh, uh, continuing to belt out, uh, you know, mournful requiem type uh, chant. You know, good appropriate music for this uh, for this solemn occasion. Okay, uh, you are out of the conversation for the next fifteen minutes, but it earns you five gold. Outstanding. Ching. Okay, so. Uh, Hearing the uh, hearing the music and uh, turning and recognizing recognizing you obviously as the adventurers he set he sent out uh, he uh, looks somber but he asks if you were successful. Oh uh, yes, we were, and I'll, one of us, whoever has it, since I don't think we really discussed that, will take out the uh, was the plant material and hand it to him. Yeah, it, it's not it's not toxic. It's you don't have to handle it specially. It just degrades very very quickly. Being the god of decay, uh, and he basically uh, hands it to a, a one of a, an associate standing nearby, uh, who recognizes it immediately and scurries off uh, to back across the street. Uh, it's our yeah. reward. Well, that's the thing. I, I unfortunately do not have it here on me. I have it in my home and my safe, but only me and my wife know the combination. Uh, while you guys were gone, uh, my daughter passed on. Oh. We are uh, required to stay here and observe her, uh, her, her spirit as it, as it passes this mortal plane. Uh, is, is, the body, is, the, is the body around? We, right do not keep the, we do not keep the body around. Uh, oh, I was looking. No, I'm asking the GM to see if I saw. So I don't see they, it. They're in, they're interred immediately. Okay, okay. Because this, is, this is just where they're. This is where the body leaves the the mortal realm, but the spirit stays. They're they're doing a ceremony to help it pass on. I will actually say a prayer to Kellenvor on her behalf. Uh, give me a charisma check at disadvantage. Disadvantage. Yes. And not perform, huh? It doesn't matter if it's probably the same. Oh, I'll tell you that's a at the disadvantage. That would be a seventeen. <laughs> okay. You, you have you have not pissed them off. Good. <laughs> I didn't exactly do it loudly either, knowing okay. that I'm not in my home temple. Okay. Uh, so, what do we have to do to get this reward? Because uh, well, I, 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 I hate to bother you again. I know you guys just uh, uh, went out and had had this all this hard earned. Uh, uh, you know, it was very difficult getting this. I'm sure. Uh, yeah, earned. That's right. Keyword. And oh, no, it is it is fully earned, but I'm willing to double it if you'll do if you'll do me one more thing. You see, my daughter, she, I, she had one dying wish, and and that was that her pet go and and be with her. Uh, it's also not doing so so well, and uh, uh, I I I can't leave and uh, with the ceremony incomplete. Uh, but by the time you guys would be back, I would be done, and I would be able to pay you. And like I said, it would be double. It would be well worth your time. All right. Yeah. yeah absolutely. Uh, What's that? I heard. Okay, uh, the pet. Oh, it's 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 just her childhood pet. Uh, it's named Legion. What was that? Uh, I'm sorry. What? Legion. 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 Yes. Uh, <coughs> and uh, everyone, give me a perception check. Uh. Perception, huh? That would be a 25. 15. Anyone with an 18 and over, uh, you notice how he, he seems to be, he seems to be uh, shifting his weight very uncomfortably as though, as though he's in pain. Something wrong? No, 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 no. Not, especially not now. Uh, thank you. I, I do appreciate you guys volunteering. And he reaches out and clasps each of your hands. And I want everyone to roll a D8. Oh, God. Okay. Six. Eight. 
five for Scott. Right, uh, seven. Seven and uh, Dizel. Uh, eight. Oh, eight, eight for yeah. uh, Ernie Dizel. and okay. Oh, no, wow. six. oh, you had a six. Okay, cool. Yeah. Okay. Uh, remember those numbers. Oh, okay. Uh, and uh, he said he, and then he gives you directions to the burial site. It's essentially uh, just through a short, a short uh, outcropping of trees on the, uh, just on the outskirts of the village. And he turns as if you and, and turns to go back to his uh, ceremony. Where's the pet? Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, everyone go ahead and take whatever your number was. Take six times that in damage. What? <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, no. I like... Uh, you are able to discern that the pet was a swarm of rot grubs. <laughs> That's not a pet. Does pass rot grubs to us. Yep, and he does not look like he's in pain anymore. What uh, did you do to us? Fuck, guys, let's book it to this uh, resting place. Hey, who's the <laughs> healer? I'm on board. Wait, 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 wait! Do you guys want me to heal you? I just took forty-eight points of damage as a wizard. That would be much appreciated. Now, why don't you actually go ahead and have that number, the, the number of grubs? Because that's, yeah, that's going to be way too, way too ridiculous. Okay, so have, multiply it by three. Yes. Thing. Okay. That's. Well, well, no, well, no, the number you rolled was the number of grubs, but it was six damage. Okay. Because and, that's, and you're able to determine that that's why it was called Legion, because it is many. Oh, well, you never specified that the rock grubs had to show up alive. So. Okay. <laughs> well, to see, remember, they're not in good shape, so they may not even make it. Of course, maybe we're healing them with whatever it is they're doing to us. Uh, you get the impression that uh, they can be killed with fire. Uh, I'm especially uh, Dizelle, You would be you would be aware of this with your studies uh, that they can be killed with fire, but you would probably you would probably not take kindly to that, and you might have problems getting paid if they uh, do not make it to the grave intact. How far is it to the grave? Uh, it is about three encounters between uh, here and the grave. <laughs> oh. Um. Uh, in, in, in logistical terms, I'm going to say that it's a half mile and you're going to be make, making damage rolls every quarter mile. All right, so nice. when everything gets down, I can, I, I, I can start burning. I can definitely start um, burning spell. Yeah, I have healing spells, so... I have, and I have mass cure, so I can definitely heal a bunch of us at once. Uh, I have a backpack. We might be able to put them in the backpack. Uh, they would not survive outside of the of the host body because they were raised by the daughter. Oh, uh, I wonder how she died. Pneumonia. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Are we familiar with this little village area? Uh. Not particularly. This is just somewhere you stopped and got commissioned on your way to go kill a dragon. Well, shit. Uh, guys, I don't want to keep these in my body for much longer, so I said we... Uh, we Let's we, go. We, Let's go, yeah. And I start uh, heading out the door. Uh, there, there's, there's essentially a path uh, through the woods that goes straight to where you're headed, so it's not difficult at all to, uh, to navigate. So if you want to head out, I suggest you do. Yep, I'll yep. leave. I'll follow. Okay. Uh, Spellcaster, since you didn't get a long rest in between heading out, go ahead and roll a d6 and knock that many spells off of your uh, off of your uh, prepared spells uh, because they're coming straight back from your adventure. Does okay. it matter which six? Nope. 
Um, where are my spill slots? Yeah, six cantrips. Well, I'm talking spell slots. I know, I know. You said it doesn't matter what. Well, well okay. That's freaking. Anyone, you're muted. Yeah, Scott's, Scott's still muted. Yeah, he's just talking. Oh, okay. Talking to us. Yeah. So uh, um, I lost four spell slots one first, one second, one fourth, one fifth. Cool. I lost two, one first, one second. Okay. I'm working on it. I lost <laughs> six. Freaking amazing. All right. I guess I I'll. The high rolls, that's nice. I am not rolling. Yeah, I'm not going to burn my. Fine. I will do a fifth. I'll do burn one from each and two first and no six. That works. I have no okay. idea what I used. So uh, a half rest is going to or a, a short rest is going to incur damage. Uh, I'll I'll make I'm going to go ahead and let you guys know that now. It's going to be one damage roll for a short rest. A long rest will kill you because they will burrow into your heart and you will die. Yeah, I don't necessarily want to rest. I'd rather just run. To that's that's yeah. fine. I'm just I'm just letting you guys know now. Oh, okay. No, I, I no. I think we got to try to get there. Gotta go, go, go. Oh, uh, we lost uh, Carol. We lost what? No, you well, cut out your video. Yeah, it's for some reason I've got an update going. Can you still hear me? Yeah, we yep. can hear. You. Yes. All right, then just to do, I'm because I can still play. I can still hear you fine, <laughs> but I've got a thing that says verifying update, and I'm not sure why. Oh, fine. Okay, so. Uh, the exposition is over. Go, go ahead, guys. It's on, up on you. Uh, it's a straight shot through the woods. I will pull out my dual swords and I'll lead the way. Guys, follow me. I'm hungry and I want to get this over with. Yep. And I am composing a poem about this right now. As we speak, I'm the reason I'm even here is because I'm following um uh this this fighter and his brave adventures and i'm composing ballads uh, based upon the uh adventures of uh of this person you're basically the reason i'm here you're you're I'm, his uh you're, you're, you're his uh, biographer yes i'm i'm your little sidekick okay uh go ahead and uh give me a survival check uh just for the hell of it. Everyone? Yeah. Uh, 21. Okay. Uh, 14. 14, and Carol? Now we, oh, now we did lose Carol. Carol's gone. Carol is officially gone, okay. Uh, well, the 20 is going to, or the, uh, someone hit a 20, 20 21. something. 21. 21. Okay, yeah, that's going to be enough to uh, be able to instruct the group so that you don't get off the path. It, it doesn't wind a whole lot, but there are some areas that are a little bit more overgrown than others. Okay. Uh, uh, you, uh, uh, are, you, are you just continuing down the, the road? How, how are you doing? What's the marching order? Yeah, I'm in front. Okay. I'll go. I'm yeah, right back. behind him. Right. I'm I'm right behind Captain Sugarbutt. Okay. Oh, okay, that's why. I'll go in the back. Okay. Uh, uh give me this is gonna be an auditory perception check. Okay. Uh everyone make it, but since your mind is busy composing a poem, uh, Dandelion, make it at disadvantage, please. Okay. All right. Do, do, do. 11. Yeah, that, that's a six for me. Eight. I am totally out of it. Caught okay. in the muse right now. Okay. Uh, easy enough? It's going to be a good poem, though. You continue it's be a great along. Poem. You continue along down the down the path a little ways, 
uh, that's going to bring us to our first quarter mile, uh, uneventful. Uh, but that first quarter mile is going to do only two damage for each grub that you got this time. All right, I'm back. Okay. I'm using a different device. Okay. This freaking tablet sucks. It decided to do an update right now. Mm. It, uh, it did producer, did, producer, did that throw us off? Is she, oh, it uh, probably did, and I'm sorry it did, but. Well, no, I'm just making sure that we're still all where we're supposed to be. Uh, don't have sure to throw technical difficulties. everything up. Uh, Welcome back. Oh, I'm so annoyed right now. You have no idea. And I'm right. trying to get it to something to kill the glare here. So, Carol, what you missed is your third in marching order. We made it the first quarter mile, and uh, your rubber grubs each do two damage now. How much? Mm -hmm. oh, <laughs> that was too fresh. Okay. I'm so sorry about that. I don't know why it's decided to like right then to update the freaking OS. Oh. User error. Hopefully my hopefully my iPhone camera will be okay because now I'm working off that. No problem. Okay, so uh, as as you're wincing from the this most recent pain, uh, you are oh. completely taken unaware, having failed your. Uh, auditory checks uh, of the rustling above you that has been essentially following you. Hey, do I get to make that check? Uh, you were gone, no. <laughs> All right, wait. How much, no, 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 go, go How ahead. much do I not get the damage then because I was go, gone? Go, 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 go ahead and make it, Carol. What was what was the damage, first of all? Uh, it was two per grub. How many do I have? It, what, what was that D6 that I told you to remember? Oh, that's the, oh, of course, naturally. And then I told you to go ahead and have that because or it was a D8 and I told you to have it. Right, eight, right, right. So, all right. So, well, I can't have seven. So, okay, I'll we'll round it up. We'll round it up to four. Fine. I'll do that. Um, no, 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 no. Round it down. Round it down. That's good. Are you sure? I'm, I'm no. No, I'm not. Right, but yeah, go ahead. And perception? Yeah. Uh, 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 auditory perception. I don't know if it does do. I don't think. Are you I in? Are problem. you in? Are you in mail? Uh, I'm, half plate. No, I'm in a adamantine half plate. So probably. It. You're going to be at disadvantage for auditory perception if you're at disadvantage for stealth. Okay. Let me just make sure. I think that is the case. Okay. I know. I'll just roll at disadvantage. Just to. Oh yeah. To, to, ha. Only a fourteen. So I probably didn't hear it either. No, it, it, that, that was a 17 check. No, uh, there's a, there was a rustling in the trees that had been following you for little ways, probably about the last 100 feet or so. And uh, you, you uh, everyone roll a d12. Oh boy. I need, the, I need the lowest one. Three. Six. Uh, looks like Scott's the lowest. I'm lowest. Oh. Every, everyone but Scott has a corpse fall on them. There is a bloated, decayed oh. corpse uh, that is just is fallen from the trees. There's people, there's dead people falling everywhere. Oh. Why are the dead people falling? First, first initiative. Oh. Oh. This is terrible. Oh. 23. <laughs> Thank God it didn't, didn't stain my clothes. That would, that would be terrible. Uh, these are pretty decayed. There probably is a little bit of a splatter on there. Gross. What? Yay, thank okay. you so much. So, rolling initiative now? Yes, please. Four for me, Chief. Oh. 20, it's a modified 24 for me. Spare some initiative points. <laughs> I wish I could. Mine's a 14. Okay. Well, that's fine. Uh, I tied with uh, Dissolve. So you all. <laughs> uh, I will go ahead and let you go first. Uh, and then I will follow up. If for some reason you kill me, uh, I will still make my actions. So uh, go ahead. Uh, there have j There's fallen bodies. Are, are the bodies doing anything to attack? They them? are. Uh, they seem to be trying to stand up, but they're not quite oh. there yet. 
Okay. Cool. Um, I will. I will stab the one closest to me with my rapier. Okay. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna hack at the one closest to me. Then I guess. Okay. Uh, go ahead and make uh, make your uh, the, the one that hit you. The so dandelion. Did you hit? No, I did not. Oh, uh, okay. I missed. All right. Uh, I looked well, great uh, no, doing uh, it, but I missed. How 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 bad? I rolled a four. Okay. Okay. Cool. Let's see. Modified. Uh. Uh. Ch -ch -ch shit. This is gonna be rough. The lowest I rolled is a ten. What? What's their AC? Uh, they're only eight. So. Cool. So all six of my attacks hit. Okay. Uh, it is. <laughs> it is actually dead now. Um. Cool. Yeah. Because I I did you know a handful of damage. And they only have twenty two hit points. Uh, okay, seven, ten, twenty-five plus. Yeah, I definitely killed it. Uh, oh, that's uh, actually, hang on, hang on. Uh, between, uh, actually, Okay. Yeah. No. Never mind. It's dead. I was gonna say it, it might have it might have risen, but no, they they're not going to. Okay. Because okay, okay. I, I did over fifty damage. Yeah. That's yeah. There's no way he's gonna. I, I can't. I can't. I can't take that on it now. Okay. Okay. Cool. Poor Jesus. Well, when they're only AC like whatever. I eight, know. Eight, eight, eight. You don't have great weapon master over there, do you? No. Dual then weapon you would have really made him into mince meat. Well, yeah. I hear all. You're well, over two on damage. Oh, I did roll one on damage on one of my die. Yeah. Brain. Who's turn? Oh, sorry, my turn. Uh, yeah, uh, you were. Uh, uh, left. Uh, there's uh, the one. Yeah, the one that uh, dandelion missed, and the one that landed on you. All right. You know what? Because I can, I'm gonna channel divinity and turn undead. Make okay. a wisdom saving throw, DC 17. Okay. Uh, what's the range on that? Uh, 30 feet. Uh, do I have I mean, to see you? Uh, let's see. Turn creature a bit. Let's see. You actually prevent your holy fit for stirring, centering the undead each time to see you or hear you. They can't okay. see me. Okay. Oh, well, uh, I think there's more enemies that we don't know about. I was going to say you're you there's uh there may be some uh, obscuring cover still that's why I'm asking. Oh okay. Well, if they can hear me, which cover ain't going to really block, this is still going to work. Okay. I'm Okay. Okay. Well, no. Uh I what uh, it's a wisdom save. It's a wisdom save DC 17. Okay, I rolled a 17, but they have minus two. So the two on the ground are just flat out destroyed, I believe. Uh, I believe so. Turn creature is... Oh, only CR, they're only CR quarter. Yeah, because at level 11, you can turn up, turn on, or kill undead, or destroy undead at, up to CR2. Yeah. Oh, okay. CR2. Yeah, so th these are only CR quarter, so you're, you're fine. Oh, quarter. I thought you said four. Okay, so, cool. So you, you effectively turn... Uh, these uh, the two that are still up and the one that was just slaughtered into ash there is nothing left of the body any viable way of transporting the rot grubs in these things is now gone oh <sighs> i was hoping to eat a little bit uh, <coughs> go ahead uh dissolve um am i prone right now because one of them landed on me I thought you were the one that, that it missed. No, I, that was me. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, no, it, okay. Then, uh... Oh, yeah, if I was prone, I would have done Yeah, I guess everyone give me a deck save. Sure. A deck save? Yeah. Uh, well, 14, 14 or higher, or you're not prone, yeah. I'm good. I'm good. I was going to say, I would have used, you know what, regardless, I would have used my move action to stand. Yeah. So it doesn't really matter what I make the save or not. Okay, so yeah, I I, did, I didn't give you bludgeoning damage from them. So yeah, if if you made your deck save, you're not you're not prone. Oh. You, just have a, you just have a wet spot. Yeah. Wait, do you want to do bludgeoning damage then? Because you, I you, would probably failed that. 
No, no, I'm fine. These are fairly, uh, fairly small corpses. You're going to be taking enough piercing as it is. <laughs> oh, goody. Well, the ones near me are, the ones near two of us are gone, so. Right. Uh, well, in that so, case, yeah. can I use my, how many more corpses are around? None that you can see. Okay. Can I use my action to make another perception check? Uh, you can, yes. Good idea. Okay, that might help. 17 plus 2 for 19. Uh, you notice that it is also raining ash. That's new. Uh, and, uh, is that, do you want to, uh, do a bonus or anything? Um, I'm not, I'm, oh, wait, I can do stone skin, can't I? I can't do stone skin, do I remove stone skin? Yeah, I'm going to cast uh, Stone Skin at fourth level. Okay. Just in case Ooh. I get ganked. All righty. Uh, and uh, amidst the uh, raining down ash, uh, three bloated, almost mutated looking piles of moss also fall from the trees above you. Uh, uh, you get the impression that those zombies probably came out of this thing. Um, oh. And, uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, and crazy. they are going to fall down on you and go after. Everyone, give me another d12. Uh, real quick, while we're rolling, uh, I'm going to take that one stone skin back because it needs an action, not a bonus action. Gotcha. Like uh, I would. I, I'll let you keep it. It would have only been a perception to know, or a bonus to notice it was raining ashes. Okay. Um, eight on the table. Seven for me. Okay. Twelve. Okay. The uh, is the high seven? one unlucky again? Anyone now? If we had two, if we had two sevens and an eight, then I'm gonna give the I'm gonna give the uh, high one the lucky roll. <clears throat> so you are each going to. Uh, hey, these things get three tentacle attacks each. Tentacles. Oof. Oh. Okay. Uh, okay. Bernie, uh, does a 24 hit you? Yes. Okay. Give me a con save. Con save. Give, yes. give me two. Con, give me two con saves. All right. So first one, not so hot. It was a twelve. Okay. The one was a fifteen. Okay. So you are going to take additional poison damage from one of those, but not from the other, because he had a twenty-five and a twenty-four. The best anyone else could do is a fourteen. Uh, so both of those are going to attack. Uh, that's nine. Uh, nine, eight is 17 plus four, 21 plus your poison damage is going to be six, 11, 14, 18. All right. Damn. And that's all that they can do now because you ate all their, you killed all their corpses, Carol. So I, I eat all the damage. Grave cleric. Oh, yeah, if yeah, you yeah, you don't you didn't take poison damage from the one that you saved against, but you take poison damage from the one you failed against. Perfect. Yeah. Is it initiative now? Yeah, now it's back to the top of the order, and I have uh, dandelion up first. Oh, okay. Okay. I will. Um... Uh, but before we go, before we start, uh, anyone within ten feet of these things, uh, give me a con save when you uh, first go. Okay. Out of way. Um, excuse me a second. Sorry. Mm -hmm. So what are we doing right now? Uh -oh. uh, when 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 you begin your turn within ten feet of one of these things, I need a con save. Right. No, I get yeah. that. What are we doing right now? We're top of the order. Okay, so we're not re-rolling initiative. No, I don't. I don't like re-rolling. That's fair. That's fair. I don't usually do it either. Yeah. So um, yeah, I I, I rolled an eleven. 
Uh, and your modifier? None. Oh, okay. Uh, you are incapacitated this round. So who is, I'm sorry, who needs to make the con save? Uh, uh, your turn. Anyone within 10 feet of one of these things, which is I pretty much going to be all of you. Okay. And you will so make that. I guess I can't do anything. Correct. Well, what is, yeah, you can't take an action. Yep. Yeah. I'm incapacitated. Fun. I'm thinking about. I think thinking is an action. <laughs> yeah. You should be able to think. All right. So, con save, right? All, all he can think about is how terrible these things smell. I, I rolled a 21 on my con save. Okay. So, you're fine. All right. Now, how many of these things are by me? Just two? Uh, there are three total. There are three total. Yes. Uh, there wasn't one after uh, after uh, rain. Got it. So I'll just attack one then, I guess. The one that went after you? Yeah, with the flurry of attacks. Okay. Um, and I rolled one crit hit. Okay. Uh, re-roll re -roll just the dice on that one, the damage dice. Roll the damage dice on the crit hit? Yes. Roll that, roll that twice. Uh, okay, I also get an extra damage dice on, on a critical hit because damage of Damage criticals, yeah, so roll it three times then. Okay. So let me do that one. Do, do, do. 11 plus 17, 28. Plus 11, 39 damage on that crit hit. Okay. And then. Uh, and 12 is the magic number for the rest of yours. Okay, so then all but one hit then. So I have okay. four more damage hits. So that would be 14 plus 16, so 30. Okay. Plus 16 is 46, plus yeah. 17, uh, 53, 63 damage extra. OK, it's looking pretty banged up, but it's still up. Damn. Uh, up next, we have Rain. All right, well, what kind of save was it again, Con? Con. Oh, that's not going to save for shit. That's an eight. You are also incapacitated. Uh, Ernie, since you saved, you no longer have to make your save. Perfect. Yeah. Uh, and Matt, go ahead. OK, so 13 plus 1 on a 14 on the con save. Oh, OK. You also pass. You don't have to make that save anymore. OK, cool. Damn it. Um, would I be able to move myself in a way where I could cast Lightning Bolt and hit all three of them? Uh, yes, but you would get opportunity attacks from two of them in order to do so. Okay. I have stone skin, which means that I have resistance to... Does, do they count as uh, magical attacks? They're... they're no, it's, they, these are just uh, regular bludgeoning attacks. Okay, so I have a resistance against those. Uh, I will take that chance. Okay. Uh... Uh, they are uh, not too uh, keen on trying to hit you. So you, you are, you are no arguments to, here. <laughs> you are able to reposition yourself unscathed. Nice. I'd like to use lightning bolt on all three of them. All three should make a dex save or if you feel this group this thing. What's your DC? Uh, DC. Oops, I should know that, shouldn't I? Uh, that's going to be 15 DC. Okay. Uh, Dex, their dex is plus two. Uh, two fail, one makes it. Two fail, one pass. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna roll and see. I'm gonna roll and see if this Wait. is the one that already hit. I'm oh, sorry. Say that one more time. I, I'm rolling to check and see if it. Okay. The one that the one that uh, failed is not the one that already hit. Okay. Um. So eight d six lightning damage on a fail or half on successful. Okay. So that's. Okay, so that's 22 for the fails and 11 for the successes. Okay. What's the lightning damage? Okay. Uh, they're all still up. 
Uh, and it is uh, their turn, unless you have a bonus. Um, not for this one. Okay. Uh, do, 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 do. What the hell do they want to do now? Oh, man, you took away all the fun parts. Um, okay. Uh, one of them is going to the, actually the one that uh, Ernie had hit is going to try and actually shamble away. Uh, if you would like to make an opportunity attack on it, you can. Do? Good thought. Uh, yes, if you would like to. Yes, I, I definitely want to attack it. Um, is it just going to be one uh, action attack? It's, it's trying to flee. Okay. So I, I definitely don't get six attacks then. I only get like no. two weapons. Um, then if that's the case, I hit with both and that is... It's an opportunity attack. You don't get two. Well, I, I get both weapons, don't I? Huh? I get both weapons, don't I? It's Not for an opportunity. Attack action? It's a single attack as an opportunity attack, I thought. Oh, uh, okay. Well then, either way, gonna, um, if, my if, if you do more than three damage, you're going to kill it regardless. Oh, okay. Well, I did 14 damage. Okay. With just it's one. It's a attack. reaction. It's not an action. So, so you don't get your full uh, action. Got it. Yeah. It's a reaction. Yeah. Okay. So that one yeah. is unsuccessful in trying to flee. Uh, the one's going after you guys. Good job. It is only one attack. Yeah. Uh, okay. Uh, I connect with a 24 and a net 20 against uh, a, a 24 against uh, Dissolve and a net 20 against Dandelion. Oh. Uh, oh, I need damn it. I'm incapacitated. I can't cancel it. Damn it. Yes, because you do not get reactions while you're oh. incapacitated. Uh, I am not taking advantage on you, though, with, with your incapacitations, though. So. Uh, so, yeah, it's like being stuck. Make your con save at disadvantage, however. Okay, I already yeah. passed it. Do I take it again? Uh, this is for this is this isn't for the stench. This is for poison damage from the attack. Okay, con save at disadvantage. Well, no, 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 no. You're not incapacitated. You, you, you're just a normal boy. So normal. Okay. Yeah, uh, dandelion's incapacitated. Uh, I'm a useless bard, Captain Sugar. Sugar, sugar beer is gonna have to save me. Save me. What, 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 what was your role? What, what was your role? Brave, brave, brave. Dan, dandelion, what was your role? Oh. Uh, my con was 13. Oh, okay. Uh, so you're going to take uh, Nine plus only 14 that time. And uh, dissolve, you take five uh, bludgeoning. So like that would be halved, so two. Because of your So I take 14 so bludgeoning damage? No, you, well, you take uh, nine bludgeoning and five poison. OK. And dissolve it would take five, but it's halved because of your resistance, so it's two. And that's top of the order. That means to see if I can't break out of this incapacitation from stench, correct? You 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 come to long enough to try not to fail again. Okay. No, that's a six. I'm oh. still overwhelmed by this terrible stench. It just it's so bad. It it just ugh, I can't stand this mess around me. If it's any consolation, the rock grubs are loving it. Well, that's great for them. I'm just disgusted at myself right now. I hate myself. I start, I start hitting myself. I hate myself. I hate all right, sugar, all right, sugar tits, you're up. Cool. Uh, so no con save, right? Uh, correct, because you passed your first one, yes. Okay. And there's none on me, so there's one on Dandelion and one on Carol? No, uh, not, there isn't one on Rain. Uh, where's the other one? Zelda? then? Yes. Okay. Um, and those are both looking mostly fine. All right. And Dandelions, I know, just did a like pretty nasty damage against Dandelion. Um, yeah, I'll probably go attack with the one on Dandelion. Okay. My hero. Yeah. And <laughs> you're welcome. 
And uh, let's see. Well, that wasn't very good. Um, so that was a nine, which I assume brave, misses. Brave, 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 brave. You're still, brave, you're still looking for 12. 12? Okay, 12. then. All right, four hit. 10, 17, 27, 30, 41. Right. 50, <laughs> three. 53 damage. Jesus. That's about half. <laughs> and uh, You're a powerful man. Powerful. I, I guess as my action or my bonus, I'll just do second win to heal myself 1d10 plus. Scary. It would have taken your bonus to get six attacks, wouldn't you? Oh, yeah. You're right. Never mind. I have no bonus. Yeah. <laughs> All oh. right, Rain. You know, honestly, with him fighting that well, does it really matter if I'm incapacitated? It's just going to take everything out. All right, hey, try again. Carol, FYI, if one gets a good attack against me, I could potentially go down. The last attack it All did right. against me was right, like you know, 50 damage. That was terrible. I'm going to blow luck. I took lucky. So I'm going to blow luck point to try to freaking get a better roll. All right. Con, did 15 make it? I forget what the hell the total was. 14. 14 was a decent. I made it, so I rolled 15. You are now you are now immune to that. Does anybody actually does anybody need healing or is everyone okay for right now? I'm at 52 hit points. Uh, I'll I'll let I'll I'll say Remember? that you can speak. Okay, I'll say that you can speak for uh, uh, while you're uh, incapacitated. Mm -hmm. I'm not incapacitated anymore. I mean No, but the other one is. Oh. Um does yeah. all how many hit points do you have? You know what? I'm gonna try it. Yeah, right, I'm, um, I'm at 28. I should be fine for this encounter. Don't be uh, so sure. Uh, -oh. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna move back beyond the reach of the tentacles. Although nothing's hitting me right now, so. You're gonna disengage. Yeah, she doesn't have to because not, uh, yeah, she didn't have one. one. Right? She didn't have one on her. Oh, you're right. It was on data line and dissolved. Yeah. Correct. Uh, spells. I'm thinking of casting something cool. Let's see. I'm thinking of casting Blight on this effer. Oh, nice. So I believe you have to make a save, right? It's I, uh, it, automatically, it automatically does max damage and I make the save at disadvantage. Uh, wow, it does? Yes. Against, it's plant plant, against the plant, yes. Oh, yes, it is. Uh, yep, 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 yep. That's right. I just haven't read far enough. Uh, I had a 20 and a 17. So what's, what is it? 17. Okay. Well, no, no. What's the modifier? What's, what's the, what's that? No, that's the save is 17. I know, but I have some negatives. What's the stat? So if, if your target is a plant creature, it takes maximum saving throw or it takes the saving throw. It's advantage and the spell does maximum damage. damage to it. No, it, it damages. It just takes half, I thought. Right. Yeah, yeah. I think it takes 88, I failed save or half as much on a success. Yeah, so it's half damage. So I don't have to roll. So 88 is. But what was the mod? What, what am I rolling against, Carol? What was I saving? Uh, oh, it was. Oh, what was the modifier? Oh, now I understand what you mean. Dur constitution. Dur dur oh, con. Um, okay. Yeah, okay. They have, they have plus two. So, okay. Ah, so yeah, the seven, the, the seven, they still, it still passes. Oh, so right, 80, still 88 30, is 64. So 32. 32. Okay. Uh, against which one? Oh God. Um, what did we get? We got one air on uh, the bard and one on. I'm gonna one do on the, the wizard. Bard. Okay. Is uh, the, the the fighter is looking like he is, you know, blowing his up pretty easily. Okay. So I'm on a sugar high right now. That one is still up, but it's looking pretty banged up. Uh, go ahead, uh, dissolve. That's me. Unless uh, you're, or, did, or did you want a healing word, someone? Oh, I could do that. Uh, how bad does the bard look, actually? You're muted. No, yeah. healing word is not a cantrip, she, so uh, I can't. Uh, I thought you could do first level. Oh, no, yeah, yeah. No, you're... it's cantrips only. Yeah, it's, yeah, yeah I guess. Bear the dying is the only thing I can do as a bonus action. Uh, there's there's some there's some dead ashes around you that you could try and spare. Yeah, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> dead ashes. Yeah, sorry, no. Okay. 
All right, dissolve them. All right, um, I'd like to use a firebolt on one of them, probably the one that looks weaker. Okay, that's the, that's the one that's not going against you. Yeah. Okay. Because um, that's the range I hit myself. <coughs> oh, that's a net 20 plus 7 for 27. Oh, very nice. Okay. Uh, very nice. Surprisingly <laughs> enough, I'm not seeing where I'm vulnerable to fire, but I'm going to go ahead and say that they are because they're plants. Um, so that's, would I double that even if it's spell? That's what I'm saying. I'm going to go ahead and say that it's vulnerable to fire. So yeah, double it. Oh, and then with the crit, it would double again. Uh, tell, just tell me if you get 20 or higher. Okay. Uh, I rolled a nine on the damage die. Okay. Um, can I add something to that? I can't remember. You should add your proficiency to that, I believe. Proficiency? Okay. So that's nine plus four, four, 13. Okay, and That's then space. And with, then with the crit, that would be no, the it, yeah, damage. Yeah, 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 it's down. It's down. Yeah, it's down. I do the thing. I do the <laughs> thing. Okay. Okay. This time the uh, what's my D four? Is stones getting concentration? Big pardon. Is stones getting concentration? It is. Yeah. Okay. But um, I haven't used another concentration spell. But that. you did take damage since you cast that. I did. You're right. It was five. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Or well, two no, damage. it was. It was. You took. It was two damage. Is what two you took. Damage. So you need a ten or higher on a con save. Okay. Guess what I did? Roll. The ten. Oh, it's two. Okay. <laughs> two uh, plus one is three. <laughs> stone skin is dropped. Okay. Uh, uh, but Sorry. It, would have still, it would have still reduced <laughs> that damage, so you're fine. Well, I was thinking that's going to be useful against the rock grub damage that you're taking <laughs> every so often. Darn it. Yeah, mm. yeah, that's, that is that is. worked on it. Uh, okay, so I'm going down the list here. I rolled a one on who I'm going to attack, and it looks like I'm going to attack Sugarbeard. Yeah. Uh, I keep talking him. You can take it. And it makes does sense. A, does a 19 get you? Nope, AC 20. Okay, so the 20 does get you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, had, I had a 19, a 14, and a 20. Oh. So Wait a minute, go ahead. Nat 20? Wait, is that Nat 20? No, a dirty 20. Oh, okay, good. <laughs> so okay. go ahead and make your con save for poison. Uh, I got a 15. Okay, you don't, oh, take, po you don't take poison, you just take... Eight bludgeoning. Eight bludgeoning. I can do that. Yep. And that brings us back to Dandelion, who is still gasping for air. Still incapacitated. Uh, I guess you're not gasping for air because it's dirty. Oh, air. man. You needed to take the lucky feet. <laughs> Carol, can you resurrect no, no, that? Right. Yeah. So is, that, is that my initiative or yeah, are you yeah, attacking we're, me? We're back to the top. Yes, I got to roll my constitution save to see if I'm still affected. By this terrible stink. It's just getting me so bad. Now that is a 17. Okay, you are also no longer affected by the stench. Yay! Thank goodness. Now is that my end of turn or is that my beginning of turn? That's beginning of turn. Okay, beginning of turn. Okay. So I will um, cast a kind of a vicious mockery. Uh, and it has to make a wisdom um, saving throw. Uh, against, um, Funny. yeah, that's a wisdom saving throw. I'm DC 16. Yeah. Uh, dirty 20. Yeah. You made it. So it does nothing. Um, if you failed, it would have been 3d4 damage, but making it, it's, it's nothing. So, uh, I will, um, um, that's, that's all I will do. Oh, that's all I can do. I can insult people. Can, can you sing us a ballad? Give us a buff. All right. I will start to sing. Uh, uh, well, see, I, my action to cast a cantrip. So I would I, I would have to do an action to start singing. Now, because he cast a cantrip, just so I, I, I refresh me, because he cast a cantrip as his action, he can cast a bonus a bonus spell of more than... Well, cantrip. as a bonus action, I can do my bardic inspiration. So I am going to give my hero an inspiration die. Captain Sugarbeard It was going to get a d10 inspiration die on his next 
attack roll. So I well, guess or it's, it's an inspiration for whatever you want to use it on, correct? Correct. Correct. Inspir <laughs> ability check, attack roll, or saving throw. How long do I keep this? I want to say 10 minutes. Yep. Got it. So use it in this combat. For 10 minutes. Love, brave, brave, uh, brave, Captain Spearbeard is going to kill all these little fox. <laughs> They're not that little, but okay. Uh, and that does bring us to uh, sugar tits. Yeah. Sugar tits. Uh, I'm gonna go after the one on dandelion still. The only one that's still around. The one, or no, the one on dandelion got killed by the by the uh, fire uh, firebolt. Oh yeah, you're right. All right, then I'm gonna go for the last one, Dizel. Okay. Um, I'm swinging at it. <coughs> and do uh, do 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 do. Four plus nine, that's 13. All right, so all my attacks hit. Let me uh, figure out damage really quick. Okay. 15, 12, 27, 37, 43. Is this round four of combat or three? Uh, I want to say three, but I'm not pot. I think three. three. I've, made, I've made three con saves to yeah. get rid of okay. stage. Two failed, one pass. I did. And I'm at the top of the order. Oh, so no, well, no, that does make it round four, though, because there was the zombies in the first round. You're correct. Oh, I'm yeah. wrong. Okay. You're correct. I'm wrong. Okay. I didn't count the zombies. Either. If we get if we get to six, you're taking an extra piercing damage. Uh, yeah, that, that was sixty-four damage. Okie dokie. Uh, fifty-two. Okay, brings us to rain. It's not dead yet. Nope. That one only had 11 damage to it. Oh, God. Um, well, for SMGs, I'm going to try Toll the Dead. So that okay. is make, you know, this is save or suck for me. Can you for once not roll high on the damn save? It is a DC. It's a wisdom save of 17. Okay. Uh, eight. That's not a 17. Excellent. So, and since it's missing, uh, here, here oh, the bat, it's missing. Uh, I am going to give. I am going to give the corpse flower resistance to necro necrotic damage, though. Fine. So that's a okay. Oh, well, Thank that you. was terrible. Wow, that was real. Yeah, that was friggin' nine points on three d twelve. So half. And ones. Uh, yep. Four. Fuck you. That D20 Reese is rolling well most of the time. I, 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 I guess I should have said you find that it's not very effective. Mm. Uh, Dizeld. Would I be able to action disengage and then bonus action cantrip? Yes. Okay. I would like to do that to put some space between me and the thing. Okay, these uh, do have 10 foot reach. These tentacles do have reach. So it's not going to be able to get an opportunity attack, but you're going to have to get pretty, uh, you're going to have to go to about 15 feet to get out of its range. Uh, okay, that's fine. The range on the firebolt's 120. Okay. So let me just go to like maybe 30 feet out or so. Okay, that's fine. Uh, and then I'd like to use firebolt as one section. Okay. Uh, four plus seven is a number that I'm calculating. It's 11. Uh, to hit, uh, that's lower than 12. I uh, yes. Okay. Now we'll miss. Okie dokie. <clears throat> uh, what am I going to do? If you're 30 feet out, I can no longer go after you. Aha! Success. These things, these things have a movement of 20. Oh, no. I'm still in range. Six. It's going to be one, two, uh, it is going to go after rain. Step back, though. Can it move? Wait, can it move? How far back were you? I would have been within 30 feet. Right. But I probably would have been, like, like at 30 feet. At 30? Okay. I could have moved. Well, let me check what my movement is here. I was going to say, what's yeah, the range? I was 30 feet, so I would have What's your range on Told the Dead? 30 feet. Okay. That's also as far as I can move, so. 
Okay, I'll give I'll I'll give you I'll give you thirty feet distance. That's fine. Okay, yeah. so between the two of them. I know I should have specified. Even okay, it's gonna go after Sugar Beard again. Yeah. Uh, and it is going to miss with all of them. All right. Which brings us yeah. to Dandelion. Everyone is immune to the incap incapacitation, so you're fine. Okay. I am going to. Um, my, my most effective is still going to be vicious mockery. So as a cantrip, uh, please give me a DC 16 um, saving throw. Six. Okay. I, I, that's wisdom, right? Yes, wisdom. Yeah. So it'll take 3D4. So that is one. Now, does it have to be able to hear you? Because these things don't know language. Yeah. It has to hear me, but it doesn't need to understand me. Okay, that works. I'll, I'll give it. So three, that's six points of damage. Psychic damage. Oh, total. Yes, six points total. Not okay. the most effective person, but I did insult it. And now it gets disadvantage on its next attack too, doesn't it? Correct. Okay. Uh, that brings us to sugar tits. Yeah. I'm slashing at this thing again. Let me know if you do more than 42 damage. Uh, I did critically fail on one. Okay. Uh, it's going to be you or Dandelion. Uh, go ahead, roll even odd. You're even. Dandelion's odd because the other two are too far away. Odd. Okay, Dandelion, you're taking friendly fire. Uh, cool. So that is going to be 11 friendly fire. So five. <laughs> All right, Dan, the line, you got five damage. And then the other, uh, all the other attacks hit the enemy. Okay. 42 is your number. Okay. 12, 14 is 26, 30, 41, 53. 53 damage. I meant 54 was your number. No. <laughs> Fuck. No, 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 no. You, you successfully kill it. It slumps over into a heap of uh, uh, meshy nonsense. Uh, you have uh, slain all of them that you were aware of. Everyone go ahead and give me a perception check. Or uh, just a perception check. Okay. 16. Uh, if, you're if you're listening... Uh, It'll be a disadvantage rain. If you're trying to look, it'll be a normal roll. I'm glad you're looking. Oh, well, no, you, you're, you're standing still, so you're fine either way. Mm-hmm. Oh, so oh, 11. 12. And Dandelion, you're muted. 19. Okay. Five. You are all unaware of anything else posing an immediate danger. Yeah, good. Okay, we're safe. Should be fine. I want to hack off some of these tentacles. Okay, go ahead and give me a. Uh, I'm going to make that one a nature check. Nature? Yeah. Um, all right, so first tentacle, 13. Uh, I'm going to make it 12 or higher. Okay, so I got one tentacle. Uh, 15 on the second tentacle, and 16 on the third tentacle. Ooh. Okay. Uh, I'm, uh, and then give me uh, one dex save as you gather them all to make sure that you don't get poison on yourself. Uh, uh, that'll also be a that'll, that'll be a 10. All right, I got a 23 on that dex save. Okay. Um, but I, I do want to nom on one, just see what it tastes like. Okay, uh, give me a con save of 18 or higher. Uh, I got a 14. Oh, jeez. Uh, big, how big of a bite did you take? I, I just was tasting it. I was nomming on the end. Just, just, just a little licky lick? Yeah. Okay, good. That, that, you're, only gonna, you're only gonna take 2d6 instead of 4d6. 2d6. Oh man, why do people want to find the great seven more seven more poison damage as you taste it? You get the impression that you could probably coat a weapon in this shit. Huh. Interesting. So I just took six of damage. Um, hey. 
Hey, by the way, uh, while he was doing all that, I want to do a mass cure wounds. Because okay. I have a feeling we need some healing. Absolutely. And that's eight. Oh, good. 16 and five is 21 points. Back to everybody. Yeah. Your rock grubs are loving that. Oh, we healed the rock grubs? Oh, yeah. Well, we're not exactly trying to kill them so yeah no they but they they're 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 feeling better you you get the impression that they could probably survive the whole way there that's perfect thanks so um hopefully that was the last encounter <laughs> uh, are, are any of the corpses like intact enough to they were they were obliter obliterated by the radiance of rain's magical words that's a shame that is a shame. Actually, wait a minute. Actually, what if I healed them? I target four creatures, and that would be my allies, up to six. So I don't think I do heal them. Okay. Well, uh, fair enough. I think that's, that's quite fine. They, were, they, they, were, they weren't actually sick anyways. They were just starving to death on the body of a sick man. Right. So um, is the ash still falling? Uh, yeah. Probably for slow, slowly over about the next 30 seconds, yeah. I try to catch one like a snowflake on my tongue. On your tongue, okay. Uh, <laughs> give me another, uh, give, first give me dex, first give me an acrobatics check. Acrobatics? Ooh, yep. I have proficiency. 27. Okay, now give, me a, now give me a con save. All right, and I have a feeling. <laughs> that was a net one! <laughs> But I got plus seven. That's eight. Maybe I should use the inspiration. That that, that would probably be a good time. Yeah. All right. Yeah, it goes away. Yeah. I got eight. So that was a sixteen. Okay. <laughs> One plus seven plus eight. Oh, sixteen okay. con save. Good God, I'm wondering why I'm wasting my healing on you. Fourteen or lower. Fourteen or lower, and you would have been taking some more uh, uh, poison damage as you ingested the uh, the, 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 the decayed remains. Does Does the snow taste good? You find it to be a bit chalky. I scoop up some and keep it for later seasoning. In what? <laughs> in whatever I decide to cook later. No, no. What do you scoop it in? Um, I don't know. <laughs> I'm sure I have a little le leather pouch or something. Um, I didn't really pay attention when I picked out the basic items. So yeah, I, mean, I, I, bet, I bet I bet that cloak of the manta ray that you're not going to be needing would make a perfect uh, uh, hobo bindle. Nah, uh, I I hope it's all right, but I'm gonna say I have a little like linen sack that I scoop it up in. So I, I, you, I'll, I'll say that you can put it in your coin first. Got it. Okay. Okay. Uh, so again, uh, having uh, dissected these things, uh, everyone, go ahead and actually give me a d20. Flat. Give me, just give me a flat 20, yeah. Seven. Six. Twelve. Ten. Uh, you notice that among the remains of the uh, 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 plant matter, uh, when they collected the, the zombies that were dusted, they had uh, about a total of 60 gold between, the th between all of the zombies on them. Cool. So you I will I them. will take five gold pieces and donate the rest to uh, to to uh, all the rest of the party members and uh, who uh, so bravely saved me uh, and I, uh, I I promise to immortalize their brave deeds in my next sonnet. How how and, 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 you still by the way? Who was the high roll? I was the high roll of a twelve. Yeah. You also find a small metallic bottle. Ooh. Drink it. <laughs> I I it's, put it's, the bottle. It's warm. In my to the, it's warm to the touch. Probably. Hey, I put the bottle in my backpack. Okay. You don't even. Hey, dandelion. It? Yes. Are you, are you still very hurt, or are you better? I'm fine. I smell terrible, but and I'm really freaked out about that. But. Oh God! We all smell terrible. Well. That's true. You all do, and I don't smell this. Just the bar has pressed the I smell terrible. But uh, well, everyone except Captain Sugarbeard, of course. 
Did, did, the, did, did the prissy bard take prestidigitation? <laughs> yes, yeah. I did, actually. <laughs> <laughs> you can make us smell better. Uh, okay. Uh, well, I'll make myself smell better. I'm not really so much worried about everyone else, but I will do that. smell like a dandelion? I, I, lilac and gooseberries, but yes. Yeah, you're not Yennefer. Okay. I know, I know, I know, I know. I just couldn't resist. Yeah. I would are, rather are smell a putrid smell to, to lure in all the animals with keen smell. <laughs> you you get the impression that this this is so severely decayed that this kind of uh, it's probably going to keep away most scavengers because this is a little too rotted. Right, right, oh. right, right. Well, I guess we so, need to keep on down the down the path to get rid of these rot grubs in the gate in the grave. Yes, yeah. you are. You are. Uh, yeah, the path ahead is uh, lies before you. Shall we press on, companions? Oh, oh yes. <laughs> I shall lead the way to adventure. Uh, are you all, and you're all set, right, Captain? Captain? Uh, I mean, I have 59 out of 121 hit points. Do you want some more healing? Well, I was going sure. to say, I'm like, one way, one way or another, you're going to take four more per grub here in a second. Yes, please. I would like healing. <laughs> uh, let's see. What do I want to do? I could cast it off the staff, too. Yeah. For now, you. Mm. Use, now I'll use my own spells. Uh, I will cast... What do I want to cast it at? I guess I'll cast Cure Wounds at third level. So 3d8. Except I roll well. Come on. 3, 7, and uh, 5. So 7 and 5 is 12, plus 5 is 17. Cool. And you don't get any bonus, like plus proficiency or character level or something? Uh, no, that's with my... Uh, my uh, that's how she was able to come up with a, a number like 17. Yeah, because it's 3d8 plus 5. Ooh, yeah. Okay. I could just cantrip you for a while. No, that's perfect. Thank you. Well, I can... Well, I could just keep... Yeah, so I could just keep... Um, Spare the dying at range. Just keep, uh, where is it? Oh, it's not a cantrip. No, you, you would have, you would have to just keep spare the dying at range and hope that when he, when he falls down, you're still up. That's true. I've got it. All right. So I say ways. load all the rock grubs into a single person. And <laughs> And Where's Erica when you need him? Maintains that one person all the way there. Who's got the most hit points? <laughs> Probably me. Who's the most hardy. <laughs> okay. Probably uh, is you. I've only got eighty-seven. You, if, if, you, if, if that's what your plan is, uh, let me know how you want to try and get him out. <laughs> <laughs> I thought we would just shake each other's hands and hope. He uh, he had a a a bond with them because he he helped raise them. Oh shit! So we don't even know how to get them out. This is great. Um, let's keep on going. Ah, uh, yeah. that's a lot of. Okay, so did you all take your uh, D four or uh, four damage per grub? Oh, oh shit! And I, of course, I pulled that off. So I have four D four, huh? Yep, and that'll put us at the half mile and at the uh, three quarter mile. We're going to make that again. That one's only three per grub, so it's a total of seven per grub since that last battle. Wait, and did we roll it? They're my pets. So wait, how much damage did yeah. we take that time? A total, a total of seven. You, you took four, and then you took another three as we approached the third quarter mile. So this one is three hit points per rock grub. Yeah, so a total of seven per grub since the last battle. Oh, that would be that. I might need some more healing soon. These people. All right. I don't have a lot of hit points to go around. And at that point, I'm going to go ahead and have everyone make a perception check. It's going to be visual. Okay. Oh, that's good. 17. 
Uh, 27. Holy crap. A dandelion is still muted. 24 for me. 24. Okay. Everyone but Dizelle is going to notice, or, or what, what did you, yeah, every, yeah, is going to notice there seems to be a faintly glowing tree poking up slightly above the canopy towards the direction that you're headed. It's, it's still a good ways off, but you notice that there seems to be, uh, some, there's something unusual uh, that you're about to be intercepting. Mm. Could that be the grape site? The, 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 uh, potentially, but you, uh, give me a survival check. Okay. 16 plus two is 18. Uh, you are able to determine that you don't think that you've gone far enough for it to be. Okay. That's what you uh, around it. You can't, you can't see it, it actually in front of you yet. You can just see it. Up, it seems to be a taller tree than the rest of them slightly, yeah. you know, but it, it's, it's, you're going to run into it if you continue along. Okay. Just, Something of note. Keep moving. Okay. Keep moving. Yeah, keep uh, moving. Okay. Uh, one. Uh, Sugar Beard, uh, there is a message for you, sir. Uh, I will accept this message. Okay. Uh, it's telepathic, a, right? A, a deer uh, approaches you and begs you not to continue. I get this via message? It, it just flat out tells you. Uh, oh, it, it speaks to me. Yep. Would the rest of us hear this? Uh, you could hear it, yes, but you're, it's not speaking particularly loudly. If you're, if you're close enough to him, you can. I, I respond and ask, why should we not continue? Uh, this is my, this is my home. I don't want, I don't want you here. Um, yeah, I attacked the deer. I was not expecting that. Congratulations, you just found the deadly encounter. I figured if a, if a deer approaches and can talk to me, I'm expecting some sort of druid. Yep. Oh, that's oh. right. Okay, you just found seven 14th level druids. Wait, really? Yep. We're fucked. Yeah. This is great. Yep. <laughs> okay. Uh, go ahead, kill Bambi. Um... Cool, let's see. I get a plus nine, so. Oh, Jesus Christ. I know, and I, you know, it shows you how much I was paying attention that night when you rolled it up. So I, I one was a, a critical succeed, and then what do, why do I need to hit for the rest? It's a deer, it's got two hit points. Oh, well, that thing's obliterated. Um, how much damage carries over, though? How much damage carries over? Oh, temporary hit points, is it a wild shape? Yep. Oh, fuck. All right, so that was a crit succeed, so that is going uh, to be... The AC is going to be 17 once it's no longer in deer. Oh, AC 17 no longer when it's deer? Yeah, but it's going to eat all of that as a deer. Yeah, that, that makes sense. Um, so what's its AC now as a deer? I don't know. Fuck it. Eight. Yeah, it's probably something like that. Um... Cool. So then I pretty much hit with every attack then in deer shape. So let me let me do the math really quick. Okay. Do your damage, subtract two from it. Okay. Uh, this is the crit succeed, so this is gonna be, a, be a five more attacks. They were they were gonna cast regeneration on all of you. Oh uh, well, too bad they sent a tasty messenger. We do have a we do have a bard that can probably negotiate. Not anymore. Not a well, well, we'll see. Uh, well, yeah, yeah, you're right. You're right. Hey, man, I'm not with him. I just <laughs> works on the road. Wait, wait, did he kill you? <laughs> he's still alive. 
He no, he popped him out of wild shape. But that's it, right? Well, no, no, no. He yeah. hurt him. He, he he hurt him pretty bad. Right, but he's not dead, right? I don't I don't know. Fourteenth level, probably not. I, I, I say, actually did a because yeah, yeah, I I know how I can salvage or help salvage this. Uh, shit. This is ridiculous. I rolled really well. Um, 89 hit points minus two. So 87 hit points. Okay. He's still up. Uh, initiative. I vote we demote captain. Lieutenant, though. Well, he's. I'm a sailor. I'm still a captain. Leader. He went without taking. That's I was going to say, did uh, if you were close enough to hear the deer, he's going to assume that you were with him. I'm going to go ahead and make that call now. So <laughs> determine <laughs> determine now if you were... Don't, Scott, we can't hear no. you. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Scott, okay. Scott, you're muted. Phone in because my phone is dying. Yeah, and and I'm and I'm you know right behind Sugarbutt, so I saw so I would have heard him everything and. Um, these yeah. people are with me, obviously. <laughs> obviously with him, yeah. So initiative. Um, I rolled a six. Matt one plus one. God damn it. Matt one plus five, six. I don't, I don't. I don't. Okay. I'll have to readjust. Okay, I just have to back up. Uh, by the way, I'm on a. I was on higher than that. I'm on a 12. I'll go with that. Unless okay. I said something already. And then sugar tits? 17. Okay, you win. Yeah, I know. Uh, followed, by, followed by rain, followed by the druids, followed by dandelion, followed by dissolve. Oh, and I roll really well in this and I don't want the oh, hell. Ernie, you have a very pissed off earth genasi in front of you who is... Uh, Getting ready to do yeah. some shit. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna say that you still get to do a. I'm really small. I'm gonna say that that was your action to attack it because you went full. You went ham on it. Yeah, that that makes sense. If I don't get it, if, 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 if you would have just attacked it once, I would have said that you still get your turn. But since you went ham, I'm yeah. gonna say that, that was your turn. So that takes us to rain. I want in there like Tasmanian devil. All right. I will just a second. All right. Um, so he's still alive. And I think this is a really bad idea to fight this. Um, I'm going to go up and I'm going to say, wait a minute, stop. I don't think we want to fight these people. And I want to heal him. Uh, you, you told, you, he was totally freaked out by the fact you were a talking deer. He doesn't I know thought it was food. He's my friend. He doesn't know these things. Can, can um, I still speak with the bonus action saying, hey, I thought it was food? Uh, sure. Yeah, since I, yeah, I thought it was food. Um, I'm trying to figure out what I want to cast here. I don't want to blow on my highest level stuff. Well, I guess I can do that. I guess I'll do Cure Wounds just to, as a show of good faith at friggin' fourth level. Jesus. Mm. Actually, I'll burn it off the. Let me figure out how the staff works. I'll burn it off the staff. <laughs> okay. Um, equipment, because I'm going to go to the staff. Ten charges. Spell slashing. You put DC DC. Spike it there. All right. So I will blow four charges to do it at fourth level. So that's ten. Oh, wow, that's pretty good. 10, 13, 21. And I assume I still have my modifier. Correct. Yep. 21, 26 points back. Okay. And hopefully, hopefully, um, Dandelion can help convince him too, because I know he's got, he's much more probably persuasive than I am. Unless uh, you would like me to make the check first and see what I get, but. I'd, ra I'd rather, if possible, I help Dandelion make a check. Uh, help is an action. Oh, okay. Um, 
Well, for what it's worth, for what it's worth, I do that anyways, and hopefully he'll make, he'll try to persuade him further. I said, I can okay. roll a persuasion, but. Okay. Uh, but I am healing, but I said, I did heal him, and I am trying to explain it. This guy's, this guy doesn't talk, you were, I guess, food. Okay. You're an animal. Uh, you notice storm clouds brewing above you as six black bears come up from behind you but they're not going to attack. But there is a storm cloud raging right now. So expect a lightning bolt for six turns. Yeah, I up. know. I've seen this before on a different game. But, the bears, aren't, but the bears aren't attacking. Call that's, off your storm. That's his turn. In the line talking. That's my turn. Uh, Dandelion is up next. It's my turn. Mm -hmm. So I will, I pull my lute out and I start to sing a song about the brave captain being so hungry and starving <laughs> and yet so confused <laughs> that he didn't know what to do. And all of a sudden this deer came bouncing through the woods, not knowing what to do. He struck bravely at the deer and yet quickly realized his folly as he realized the deer would not be giving his jolly and on and so forth and so forth. Singing the praises of the captain, make a per performance check. And the disadvantage. praises of the captain and the beauty of the deer and the forest. The praises of the captain is all that's important. The, oh, druids, don't, the druids don't want to fuck the deer. God damn it. All right, so um, well, what I need to make what now? Performance at disadvantage. Performance at disadvantage. Three, so that is a 15. The bears. Okay, uh, yep, they had their turn. So they're, they, 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 they their uh, hockles uh, start to uh, bristle a little bit. They're a little irritated. Crap. Uh, dissolve. Um, can I just ready an action? Um, uh, this is end of the round. Would it would it carry over the next round? Uh, essentially, Until the next it depends round. on what the action is. Um, because you're going to have to. Okay, who's got ranged abilities? Well, well, no, yeah, it would it would be until your next turn, I would say. So yeah. Okay. Who's got ranged abilities? I do. Okay, I do. I'm not really, uh, other than my okay. perfect voice. Okay. Um, all right. Oh, I don't even have that one prepared. Oh, I can't even do that. Okay. Um, I'm going to hold action to cast Flaming Sphere if someone attacked, or if one of the... Um, do I have to declare like specific targets, or can I just say if one of the druids attacks? You can you can just say one of them, but if you're going to say druid, I'm going to since I that's player knowledge versus character knowledge. I'm going to say one of the bears or the druid. Um, I'll say specific, or, or you can or you can say someone if until some something attacks someone. Okay, you know I'll, I'll I'm going to hold exp, uh, expeditious retreat onto myself if I see the druid that I know is a druid. Uh, attack anyone. Okay. Explanations for treat, not um, uh, flaming okay. script. Okay, that works. Uh, that brings us to the top of the order. Sugar tits, what do you want to do? You still got a pissed off one looking at Dandelion. Uh, Come on. Sorry. Wow, guys. I really thought you were a deer. Um, I was. Tasty deer. Uh, rocks aren't tasty, though. I, I apologize for the misunderstanding. I, I still don't want you here. What? I still don't want you here. Um, okay, well, we are trying to actually make it to a gravesite on the other side of your area. Um, a couple, maybe, I don't know, a mile away or something? I don't know. I'm not the smart one in the group. 
Rain, please like explain. We left. Uh, well, you're not going this way. Is there an alternate path? Yeah, that way or that way. So is there a fork in the road or is, is he just saying go back the way you came? I'm telling you to go through the woods. All he's, right. He's, he's, saying, he's saying you need to make a priest pretty much saying that you're about to hit their sacred tree. Got it. Okay. Well, uh, I apologize for the misunderstanding. We'll be on our way. We'll accompany you. Uh, thank you. Need the guidance. I guess that's it. I'll I'll just like start to walk off into the woods where they pointed. Left or right? Um, I don't know. I turn and ask Rain. Rain, do do you remember where we're going? Hurry up! Hurry up! Uh, which way? Which is all right? So, out of game question to the GM: Which way is which way is less out of the way? You're, where you're headed is directly in front of you. Either way, is go, you're going to have to walk, you're going to have to go off the path and go give it a wide berth. So either, right. way it's going, either way, it's, it's essentially going to be equally as uh, is it, out of the way either way. We'll go right. Sure. All right, Rain, I'll take your direction and I step off to the right into the forest, the way that they pointed. Okay, the bears start closing the distance between their people, the rest of the party in the rear. I mean, I, I head off and I'll be like, fine, join us. We're fine with that. Second with the cleric. We can probably use the help at this point, carrying around one of storm cloud the isn't nature's dissipating. creatures. This, the storm clouds aren't dissipating. Oh, can I make an insight check on the druid? Go ahead. Uh, what are you trying to discern? Uh, more or less, if we're going to get murdered while our backs are turned. Okay, go ahead and roll. Okay. Uh, ooh, nat twenty plus two. If you don't, if you don't do anything else, you're, you, they won't hurt you. Okay. They just don't want you going this way. This this area is very sacred to them, and you are not permitted here. Got it. Okay. That's what you. That's what your twenty is able to get. Tell you, you the the uh, DC might have been a thirty, but okay. uh, the bears are still closing the distance. Though they're they're not. If if you don't comply, you also will be hurt. I'm following the clarity. There we go. And dandelions on sugar tits ass, and he's also muted. Yes, I'm on Sugar Tit's ass, and I, 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 my natural curiosity has to um, ask a little bit. Um, I, I inform them I'm a very famous bard, and I would love to know more about this holy tree. And um, you know, maybe not, not, if, if it's I not, could it's not, a, it's, it's not for you. You're not of the earth. I, 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 but I, if I had a better description of it, then I could warn others to stay away. Give me a persuasion check. That's a 22, modified. Okay. Maybe just so I could draw and then put it on a map and have a big. No, we don't. What we don't need it. To, we don't need people coming by. No map. No map. Okay. Okay. I. I. I would love to somehow make sure that this tree, when other people see this tree, they know to stay away and to leave you alone. Could you describe the tree to me so that I can keep this in my ballads as a sacred and holy oak or maple or birch or whatever it is, and with sufficient warnings to keep everyone away from it? It is a ponderosa pine. That's what Ooh, I heard ponderosa has good stakes. It's also the name of a nudist beach. And are you sure there's no way that we can take a good look at it and then just go around? Just, 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 just keep going. Escorted, of course. 
but this way we'll have the image stuck in our head to make sure that no one ever comes down this way again, because we'll be able to accurately describe. You can go by your, you can go with, you can, you can, your friends go around. Okay, that sounds like a great idea. Split the party. Oh. <laughs> so I'll I'll uh, go. He, will, he he is offering to let you look at it. He's not offering to allow you through, but he's offering to allow you to look at it. Okay, that, that's all I need. I just need the image burned in my head, okay. so that the way I can give it a proper noble introduction in my future ballads and sonnets to let people know to stay away from this area, but I want to accurately describe what they need to avoid. Okay. Uh, Dandelion, yeah. if you see anything tasty, please bring it back. I will, don't worry. Yeah, I, I got you. Okay, so are you going, the bears are still... Wh whoever I'm communicating with is gonna allow me to show, I'm gonna just he's, follow him. He's standing there and they are trying to close the gap in between you and the rest of the party to, to issue them along. Yeah, I'll just work my way uh, to you're, visual. You're, 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 you're with, uh, you're with uh, I'm going to call him Stoneface. Uh, and right. and uh, the bears are closing the gift or are, are forming a, are starting to form a barrier between you and the rest of the party. They understand what's going on. Okay. Uh, and they are still continuing to close the gap as though they expect the party to continue on. What are you guys doing? Uh, I, I'm cool with continuing on. And then the line continue on. on. I'm with them. Okay. Uh, he will escort, we'll, we'll, we'll start with Scott. He will take you about another 300 feet uh, along the path and holds out an arm as, you know, doing the soccer mom arm save. He doesn't want you to go any further. Right. And he shows you this tree. It's a majestic tree, a wonderful ponderosa pine, worthy of many praises and fantastic songs of adulation and admiration. And I thank you very much for this fantastic honor. And I will be joining our group and we know to stay away from any sight distance of this magnificent tree. And I will back around and try to join the rest of the group and say, make sure this tree we stay far away from. That detour is gonna cost you another roll from the, from the rock grubs. As, as you are taken off of the path and then backtracking around back. So you're gonna take right. four per rock grub. Uh, a cleric, I might need some healing. I'm like, fine. No, no one, no, that one, that's no one else yet. That's just, that's, that's, that's oh, that's just, just him. Dandelion. Okay, that's sorry. Dandelion because he wanted to, he wanted to go play a uh, fern gully. <laughs> and I'll explain. You, 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 you see, we have to. We're all infected with a terrible disease, and we're trying to get to the place where we can be cured as fast as possible. Uh, th th this is why we were trying to cut through your forest. No, no disrespect was was ever meant. Just a simple preservation of life. No more. He pauses for a second. He he, he sizes you up. Uh, I have a nineteen charisma, so I'll probably have pretty good size. He rolled a net twenty on his insight check. Is any of that untrue? No, that's actually one hundred percent true. Okay. Uh, he, uh, give, go ahead and give me a persuasion at advantage. So 19 plus. Okay. That's, that's, that's plenty. That's a 25. That's plenty. Uh, he actually is still going to go ahead and cast regeneration on you. Oh, that's, that's fantastic. Thank you so much. You Thank will, you, so much. you will get back. Uh, one, uh, ten, pit, 10 hit points every uh, minute for the next hour. Oh, man. Outstanding. After a while, I should be more or less back. I mean, uh, things, I, I will thank him profusely. 
And uh, um, it, it is true. We were trying to take this route as the quickest route possible through here to rid ourselves, rid ourselves of this infection. That was 100% true. There was no lie in that at all. Yeah, yeah. He's his face. His face isn't still give, isn't giving up much, but yeah, yeah. I, I understand. Okay. Well, ho hopefully we can join, and then make since we know where we can't get to, we should be able to keep distance from that area and circumvent. As, and make as, 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 you're, as you're talking, he casts a wall of thorns in between you and himself, and he fades back into the forest. Ah, okay. Your, your path back is blocked, but your path forward is clear uh, to rejoin the party, and you are now also <clears throat> constantly healing. Yes. I'm, okay, good. Good, good. I hopefully rejoin the party and uh, say uh, we have to circumvent this big wall of thorns, and uh, we're not going to be able to get back in there. Sorry, and I tell Sugar Beer, look, there's lots of really good stuff to eat in there, but man, I wouldn't eat anything there at all. Why, why didn't you bring any? Because the guy was like right there, right there, you know, and... All right, at least now we know where it is. We can always come back after we uh, deliver these rock grubs. <laughs> it's true. A lot of really big, fat squirrels and mm, rabbits. Oh, that bear meat, I heard, is good. Bear meat is oh, gamey. You, 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 you would bear it. go ahead and go ahead and give me an intelligence check, uh, sugar beard. Oh, with food or just, just, a, just an intelligence check. Can I kick him? 12. Uh, with, kick him? with a 12, you are able to, uh, you're wondering where that deer meat went. What <laughs> I, I didn't see it turn into the earth ganasi when I. Wait. Thinking, thinking about all of the bear meat that you can conjure makes you think of where the where the deer meat might have gone to. Mm, to the bears. Mm, I don't know, but I need to find some. Yep. Okay. All right. You continue along. You circumvented that. You did not die. Thank God. Yep. Uh, Eric Hall. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Not Eric. <Aerosol. laughs> uh, okay. Uh, puts us through the cops of trees. That rolls a five, so take more damage. Five per. Yep. Uh, we'll go ahead and make that one twice. Uh, that one's a six. Uh, can we pause after that first one? Yeah, you, you can pause during any of these. I'm just okay. telling you, progressing. Hey, uh, Claire, I feel like I'm about to fall apart. Uh, so, how, how, much, how much are we taking this time? Uh, the first one is five. I'm just checking off the, I have it broken down by quarter miles. So I'm just, I'm, I'm rolling for two quarter miles here. All right. So give me the, fir the first quarter mile is five per grub. The second one for this set session is going to be six. Yeah, I'll, I'll so cast five, that's um, 11 mass. Per grub? You take, you take five for the first quarter mile after the cops of trees. And then the second quarter mile from the cops of trees, you're going to take another six. Good mm. crap, that's 33 points of damage. Yeah. I'd also like to request healing midway between them. Uh, I think we're I've all going to need it. Yeah, yeah, that's what that's why it's broken up that way. I'm yeah, I I'm I'll cast uh I'll cast mass healing uh mass heal. I have that as well. Um I'll just cast it at um yeah, mass cure wounds. I'll cast it at its normal thing uh fourth level. Um right. So that'll be uh, 17 hit points to everyone. Okay, let's see where we're at. Okay. Uh, re read me the heal, that, that heal spell. Yeah, that's uh, mass cure wounds. Uh, facing the mic. Sorry, mass cure wounds. Uh, way oh, no, it was, it was cure wounds. I thought, I thought there yeah. was definitely mass heal, okay. No, 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 cure wounds. Yeah, mass just cure don't wounds, cast yeah. cure disease or all the rock grubs die. Okay, so uh, seventeen hit points of healing to Zelda. Between uh, yeah, between the, the the first two legs of that, is everyone good? Good now? Yep. Better. Okay, how much was the second part? Six per grub for the second part. All right, cool. I'm dead. You're you're at zero hit points. I, I I'm down to zero with that. 
Well, you jump back healing? up to... Well, I was going to say, if you wanted to request more healing before we continued, you could have. You would have had that opportunity. Uh, I, don't, I don't know how much... I wouldn't know how much I would take during that trend, uh, transition, though. Would I? Uh, you, you, you give me an intelligence check. Okay. Dead. So that's 10 plus, I think it's three. Yeah, 13. Okay, 13. Uh, I will say that you were been able to determine approximately what intervals you, you were, you were feeling the pains from it mm -hmm. so that you would know when approximately probably within five or 10 minutes of when you would take that six. Okay. So if you did, if you did want to try and prevent that somehow, I would give you the opportunity to. How many does, how many rock up does he have on him? Yeah. What was that? D thing? I rolled eight and then you said yeah. to half it to four. Yeah. So it would be 24 damage there. Yeah. Mm. So would you have wanted to, would you have wanted to uh, request more healing? I would like to do that. I was going to. Oh uh, uh, yeah. The, if, if when I when I was asking if everyone was still good, if you yeah, if you would have wanted more, you would have had that opportunity. Um. Well, I can do that too, and I'll still have one more via the staff if needed. Um. I I don't have any more mass cure wounds. I, no, I, I I have I have one more, and I also have the staff too. So I can do. I assume everybody still would need more. That's pretty good right there. Ah. You had a truck on the third one. So that was 17 and five is 22 points back to everybody. Okay. Does that, does that big, yeah. Before you take your 24, does that make everyone feel a little bit more? That with the other regeneration, I'm, I was I'm say, 100 you're, back. You're not, you're not. You, yeah, dandelion's not ever really going to. Uh, you're you're moving at a rate of about. Uh, I'm gonna say, two mile an hour. So you're fine. Yeah. See, that was what level? Uh, the, and that would have been the sixth. Is fifth. All right. So vascular rooms is fifth. Wait. As a matter of fact, I'll go up to Desild. And and uh, say, I received some some regenerative healing from the druids uh, due to them loving my songs. Um, perhaps I may be able to transfer some of these grubs from you to me, because I believe that the healing will allow me to um, will allow me to to uh, to counteract their uh, their um, things. So I'll I'll. I'll hug him. I'll hug him and say, "There, there, Dezel. There, there." I'll hug back to Dandelion. Give me a bro hug check. <laughs> <laughs> uh, would, uh, would that be charisma? Uh, sure. Okay. Oh no. <laughs> What's my charisma <clears throat> zero? Okay, I have I have a three on my end. Okay, I have um. I'll do a charisma. I have uh, that's gonna be a fifteen, just a straight charisma, Jack. D D Dandelion, that hug yeah. lingers just a little too long. Where <laughs> 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 where it's it's just you're like you're you're, 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 you're like uncomfortable. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thanks, I needed this. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> uh, uh, if, if, if he is offering to do that, uh, Desold, I would say, actually, both of you, give me an intelligence check. Uh, if you're proficient in nature, make it a nature check. You mean, uh, you mean survival? No, nature. Uh, nature. I'm half proficient. I'm not yeah, jack of all trades means you're. I'll, I'll I'll give you I'll give you proficiency for it. You can make your nature check. Okay. You would, yeah, you're you're a bard. You can have it. Yeah, eleven plus three, so that's a fourteen. Okay. That's six plus three, which is nine. Uh, 
Dandelion, you know that the way to get, uh, you, you know that rot grubs are, are the larval stage of some sort of an arachnid. Uh, and you know that like, like a tick, you've seen, you've seen people uh, hold uh, torches up to ticks. Mm -hmm. And that, that, that gets them out. So you think that you might actually have to uh, uh, try something a, a little bit more invasive to actually tr try and, uh, if you want to try and get some of them out off of them. Uh, not uh, just a uh, hug, huh? Yeah, you're probably going to have to try and poke them out. Our, our wizard knows uh, fire spells. I have green flame blade as a cantrip. Fire, fire directly will kill them. Hmm. Uh, but nearby, it'll scare them off. It'll yes, that's what I'm saying. It'll, you're you're wanting to try to uh, negotiate them through the tunnel that they've already woven through his skin. Hmm. Right. That's kind of gross. But yeah. Maybe um, you can speak to them, Dandelion. I'm trying to think. I don't know if I. What 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 are languages do they speak? None. None. Damn it. Intelligence is a one. I'm <laughs> thinking, come here, little grubbies. Come here, little grubbies. Hey, AOGM, what did we notice about? I mean, I know that her father transferred them to us, and it was a handshake. So, what was there something special about it that got them to? You transfer? were a more viable life source than he was. He was pretty much almost dead from these things. Oh, so we have to almost kill ourselves. Well, Oh, so like me right now. <laughs> yeah, he's it, yeah, he's actually pretty far down, and I would assume the other guy with the regeneration is a more viable life source. Yeah, but I didn't roll good. That's the problem. Well, yeah. I, I, I would, I, I'm still going to say that you're going to have to try and you're going to have to you're going to have to hurt him to get him. You're going to have to dig him out. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Okay. Just, That's fun. Hi, you know what? We're not far. Why don't we just get there? Right. Yeah, let's just get there. We're wasting okay. time, guys. I'm sorry, but we should just go. It was a good idea, though, for the. All right. Let's roll with it. Of doing the same thing, to be honest. We're okay, were you? I appreciate yeah. the dandelion. Uh, I appreciate the hug. Let's <laughs> go. Uh, actually, then, Rain and Dezzled, you actually begin to give me a give me a wisdom save. A uh, wisdom wisdom both, yeah, save. Yeah, both, both of you. Yeah, wisdom save. Uh, that's well, I got a good wisdom save, so that's a twenty. The threes are coming fast and hard, but luckily, I have a plus seven in wisdom for save, right? Yes. Okay, ten. Twelve. Ten. Uh, you. You almost hear Dandelion's backpack calling to you. What? What's in his backpack? Saying, I can fix this problem. D D Dandelion, what you got in your backpack that's talking? You don't, you don't hear it. Oh, I don't hear it. You made your save. You don't hear it. Oh. It's not here, but... No, I kind of uh, wish I had faith. It, it, it's not. It's not. It's not an actual voice. It's a compulsion. Uh, I see. Hmm. Do I need to act on it? Uh, you don't have to. Hmm. The temptation is there, and it's going. That voice is going to continue to get louder as you continue to take damage. Can I make a perception check to see inside of his backpack and determine what it is? Uh, if he lets you. Otherwise it's like otherwise it's sleight of hand. Okay. He's not here, so I can't ask him for permission. Oh, we're, oh yeah. Uh, go ahead and make your roll. For what? Huh? For which what roll? You just make a go ahead and do your roll. And then I'll uh, seventeen plus I, I was gonna say, do, would you would you want to ask him or not? I would want to ask him. Okay. So I'm not going to give you sleight of hand because you're making him aware of it. So he's going to at least know. So okay. it'll be whether or not he agrees. Okay. Or are you going to try and forcibly stop him? Uh, I figured I'd just ask him. It's not too okay. bad. Yeah, you, you guys just hugged it out. You're on good terms. That makes sense. 
Okay. Uh, see, I don't know what else. I don't know what all he has in there. Otherwise, I would uh, say that. Uh, I, since he's gone, I'm just going to give it to you. Yeah, you 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 notice a glowing metal bottle in there. Probably a genie. Uh. Nice. Give me an. Yeah, I'll give you an Arcana check for it. Okay. Well, good. My Arcana is plus seven. On well, that's thirteen for twenty. Oh yeah, you you get the impression that there's a, that there's a there's there's a, a some sort of a gin gin inside. Okay. Or at least this is something that would typically house one. Dandelion. You mind if I hold on to this in case I need it? Yeah, yeah of course. That's fine. That's fine. No problem whatsoever. Thank Did you. you tell us what you found? It's a bottle. I think it's got some kind of a spirit inside of it. It's, I think it might be able to help if I get too low. You don't, you don't know if there is anything inside it. You would just oh, recognize sorry. that this is with the arcane engravings, that this is something that typically would be used for that purpose. Oh, man. What Open, it up. Open it up. Do you need me to taste it? Um... I don't know if it's worth the taste, but I suppose we'll crack it open. Why not hurt? And I'll pop the lid. Okay. This can only end well. Just gonna throw it out there. Nothing but positive feelings for so everything. You're popping right the lid? Pop the lid. It, is this so I can get a taste? Does anything happen? When I, I, I was gonna I was gonna say, are you doing it in your hand? Or is is he trying to drink from it? How's it happening? I figured I'd just pop it in my hand. Like just okay. open the lid. While I'm holding it, I'm not get, showing it anywhere near Captain. Not okay. anywhere near me. I don't want him to drink it. <laughs> uh, roll to one. Perfect. Uh, it's an Afridi. Uh, and it has been it. And rolling a one means it has been in there for so long that it is absolutely psychotic and it immediately attacks you. Oh, right. oh yay. I got yeah. fooled. <laughs> Can we at least yay. Get to, did we at least get to the destination? No. <laughs> you got you no got point. one more you, you got one more league left. The best thing is the freebie attacks with fire, so maybe the rock grubs will disappear. Yeah, and then you will get, get them paid. there. Win win, and, and then you won't get paid. We'll he only get paid get the original him. amount, right? Nope. He's gonna be pissed off. Oh uh, well, he's a dick. I mean, I guess technically you don't know, but uh, you know that the money's in his safe in his house, and he's well, not. He won't know. <laughs> so he is, oh, that's true. I'm getting paid. <laughs> Ergo, <laughs> we'll get paid. <laughs> he 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 pops out, turns to you, and conjures a fire elemental. And that's what he's going to do, and we're going to roll initiative. Yay. Oh, damn it. 18. 15. 25. Uh, any of those natural? Yeah, it's a uh, nat 20. Okay. I'm on a 19. I had a natural 20, but I only get a plus one, so I'm at 21. Uh, sugar tits? 18. And dissolve? Uh, 15. 15. Okie dokie. So, Dandelion, start us off. This thing pops out, is glaring at dissolve, and it just made a friend. I'm going to cast Sleet Storm right on top of it. Okay. And um, tell Dizel he's got to run the hell away. And uh, so, so the action I'm casting Sleet Storm as a bonus action. Uh, what uh, what is 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 Sleet Storm area of effect? Because Dizel it is area of it, it is was, area of effect. Let, let me let me plot this out how I'm doing correctly. Uh, how, how I have to do this? They're they're essentially sharing the same space. Right. So. Uh, what I can do is I can, as a bonus action, spend one bardic inspiration to um, 
grant 11 temporary hit points to four creatures you can see, and each creature immediately can use its reaction to move up to its speed without provoking opportunity attacks. So as a bonus action, I'm doing Mantle of Inspiration to everyone, so I'm back the hell out. I'm cast, you know, right there. So I was going to get 11 temporary hit points, clear out a space. That's what I'm telling you. And then I'm throwing as my action, Fleet Storm, right where those, uh, um, with your Freet and the Fire Elemental is. Okay. All right, so, so we get 11 temporary hit points then. You get 11 yes. temporary. I can do the four people I can see. So 11 temporary hit points. You get a reaction to move your speed. And, and I'm dropping an action, a spell for Sleet Storm. And, and what is the area on, what's the radius 30 on? Feet, um, uh, 30 feet uh, pillar, basically. Okay, what's, what's your movement dissolve? Um, I have the mobile feet, so my movement's forward. Perfect, okay. You are able to get out of it. Uh, now, the rest of you are also going to have to move or get caught on it. Yeah, I definitely want to charge in if I find out that I can move. Yeah, you can you can move right into it. Yeah, I'm gonna charge in. No. Run, How was run, I supposed run, to know that we were supposed to move out? I no, just found out that I can move right he now. Didn't, he, didn't, uh, he, did no, he did not know that he did not know that the sleet he did not know that the sleet storm was coming when he was given the movement. Yep, I'm charging in. God damn it. Is that fair? Does everyone agree with that? That's fair, but it, it doesn't do damage. It just makes it slick and it and it douses. It. It's heavily obscured, and it and it's the uh, the ground is is difficult terrain. That's that. It does not do any damage. It just it's like you know heavily obscured douses any exposed flame, and the area is covered in ice, making it difficult terrain. Okay. Slowing it down. <laughs> That's that's the point. Slowing it down and maybe us get the hell out or or whatever we're gonna do. But it's it's a uh, light casting fog and getting the hell out. Okay. Uh, okay. So seeing uh, seeing this this sleet and seeing that it is about to be attacked, it is going to cast gaseous form. Okay. Because that's because I am after uh, I am after Dandelion. Right. And right. Rain, you're after uh, you're, you're right after me. Right. Okay. And then then Rain uh, and then uh, Sugarbeard. Uh, so. So you don't charge it yet. So well, no, I'm... he 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 charges it. He just can't attack it yet. He's he's used his movement, and he is going to have to make a Dex check. No, 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 because yeah, but aren't I going before him? I I also rolled a natural twenty. No, I mean, aren't <laughs> I going? Before Sugar Beard, you you were you were going before Sugar Beard, yes. So you. And you, I'm but, gonna yell. I'm gonna make everybody run to the spot. The the but uh, thing I, but is, I I go, the, but I go yeah. first. No, that's fine. You can go first. Yeah, yeah. So he goes gaseous. Yes. And uh, I want to make sure. I'm okay, I can't do that with the fire elemental. So the fire elemental is going to attack. It's, it's important to note that the movement was a reaction. So everyone got basically one reaction to right. move. That's why Captain right. Sugarbeard was able to close and go in. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, you have nothing to do with this action, nothing to do with initiative order. That's everyone immediately oh, okay, takes okay, reaction, okay. right? Yes. Out of turn, just Correct. That's, that's how that works. Thank, thank and you. I for run that. towards the yeah. area. Yes. So. I get your tactics, man. Okay, so uh, it is going to. Uh, ooh, I am going to say. I'm, I'm just reading this. For every gallon of water splashed on it, it takes one damage. One cold damage. <laughs> So I'm trying to fit and with this sleet storm. I'm trying to actually quantify that. Uh, do we want to say 15 damage a turn in the, in the sleet storm is going to be fair? On the fire elemental? Yeah, for the fire elemental. That's fair to me. I mean, okay, yeah. Then, then that's that, 
that's that's what we'll do. It's going to, so it's going to take fifteen at the start of every at the start of every turn until it gets out of there. Okay. Uh, okay. So. Uh, It is going to move out of that, out of that, uh, and it is going to enter. Uh, it has a range of, it has a speed of fifty feet, but it's difficult terrain, so it's going to be half speed. Uh, so, who is who is within twenty five feet of that? You, you've all, so the only one is probably. I think we all going, I, I'm probably within twenty five feet. I would think. Uh, yeah, you, you should be, and I don't know if. Well, dandelion wouldn't be if he didn't, unless he cast it on himself. What uh, What's the range on that sleet storm, dandelion? Uh, One hundred and fifty feet. Okay. So, how far out were you when you cast it? Um, I guess I'm probably about twenty feet away from where the efreets were. Um, I have to assume that we were generally within. So, so did you moved as well. Yes, Otherwise, yes, I would, I would, I would move this, I would move out of the range of my own area, yes. So, okay, that's, that's what I was trying to figure out is how close you were to him. Okay, so. I'm only, but I wouldn't move that far away, right? I mean, I'm going to move out of the range of the spell, which is going to be. Yeah, 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 if you're, you, the, the, the radius is 30 feet and I have a movement of 25 and I'm assuming it was centered on me. So I'm going, I'm not going to be able to exit this time. That's what I was. Okay, okay. 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 So, right, the radius, you can't, right, it's a radius of 30 feet. So you only go 25. That's what I'm saying. I'm not going to be able to exit the. Oh, you're not. Okay. I heard, I heard it to you. Yeah. I'm like, yeah. Huh? So I am going to have to attack a uh, sugar beard. Uh, with fire? Uh, yes, with fire. How's the rock grubs going to handle it? Uh, oh, wow. They're not going to like it, uh, especially because you take fire damage just from being next to this thing. Yes. Fire form, right? Yeah. All right. First time it enters a creature space on turn, creature takes 1d10 fire damage. Mm -hmm. Cool. Well, someone takes an action to death. <laughs> and then okay. So yeah, you are, you're 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 not going you're not going to catch fire, but you are going to be singed by it. So you're going to take 1d10, uh, which is going to be six. Okay. Uh, and it is going to go ahead and attack you. Oh, go ahead. Cleanse okay. me of these yeah, rock yeah, you're, not, you're, not going to, you're not going to ignite, but it is going to attack you. Uh, uh, 18 hit. No, you're 20, aren't you? Yes. So it does nothing. Ha, ha, ha. But you did take that fire damage. And how are the rock grubs doing? Uh, they they've been burrowing into you for the last mile and a half. They're not they're not killed by a uh, uh, superficial fire at this point. Oh, they're they're not feeling a little toasty and uncomfortable. They're not they're not particularly fond of it. They're writhing. Got it. Thank you. Uh, Maybe you get the impression, you get the impression that you get the impression that if you take some more fire damage, they're probably going to try and they're they're going to speed up trying to burrow into you. Okay, that makes sense. Ew. Yeah, but that's that's uh, all I can do. The free the free is now in gaseous form and it is moving towards dandelion. At uh, flying at ten feet. Ten feet, correct. So it's still in there, but it's not taking damage from the sleet because it's not in fire form. Right. So uh, then it is Rain's turn. Um, well, I'll use, I'll use one of my favorites. Uh, why don't I try casting Bane? We got two targets, so that should work. Is what's uh, it give, uh, give me a, a. Oh, wait, no, no, it's a fire element. Well, what about the Afrit? Well, the Afrit, I'm, I'm going to say that the Afrit is effectively invisible. You're going to have to make a 
Oh, okay. Because it, 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 it still see it, even though it's like in, well, well, but in this, in this, in this sleet, the way the way it's been described to me, I'm going to say that it's able to blend in. Oh, then no, 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 I won't do that. Then um, you're right. Does I can't that, does see. that I'm also just gonna, sound, sound fair, dandelion? The way you described that. Nope, that's that's. You're, you're muted. I can't see it. I won't do this. No, yes. instead, I'm going to just actually keep running. I'm going to use. But all my actions to just keep moving towards the spot. Uh, the gra the grave site. Yep. So that would oh. be to be my standard thirty foot move, then a dash action to keep going. Okay. Uh, you are. Uh, give me a survival check. Survival check. Uh, this will be funny. Oh, actually, I mean, because it's a wisdom based one, it's actually not horrible. Ah, that was good. Nineteen. You get the impression you're probably about 500 feet away. I'm going to keep going. Okay. I'm going to complete this freaking mission. <laughs> yep. Before I get hit by a fiery thing. Okay. I'm eat things or be eaten. Either way. Okay, so that's that's her turn. Uh, Sugarbeard is up. Uh, there is a fire elemental all up on you. Okay, so Ooh. only one of my weapons is magical. Okay. So um, half of my d damage is going to do full, I think, and then the other half is going to be halved. Correct. Okay. So, um, it, does it matter which one is magical? Uh, are, 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 they, are they the same? Magical. Are they are they the same base? Yeah, they, it, they all get the same. Um, because I have okay. a fighter ability. Okay. Um, well, I meant I meant the base damage. There, it's you're, it's two rapiers, right? Uh, yeah. Okay. So it's one d eight plus nine. Um, so my first attack, the lowest. So from my magical side, the lowest I rolled is a 26. So I assume that hits with all, all three. Uh, thir 13 is the AC. 13 is AC. All right, now I'll do my offhand. And all my offhands hit. So I'll do my primary damage first, Okay. which will be full. Yep. So let me go to my dice roller tab really quickly. Here it is. But it is still considered piercing, so it's actually all going to be resist. It's all, it's all going to be... It's magical, but it's piercing. Uh, right, but it's magical, so there's no resistance. Because fire elemental has damage resistance to bludgeoning, piercing, and slashing from non-magical attacks. Oh, okay. Yeah, I, I okay. I, I, yeah, I, I, I read from as and. Oh, yeah. I, I totally get that. <laughs> okay. I, get that. I do that all the time. Um, yeah, I totally um, get that one. 39. So 39 damage uh, from the main. So that's not halved. And now 26, 27, 37, halved. 15 plus 18 is, is halved from my offhand. Okay. It's it's still uh it's it's still burning, but it's its flame is uh dwindling pretty uh, significantly. Uh, that puts us to dissolve. Okay. Uh, can I see where the Efreet went? Give me perception at disadvantage. Okay. That's my perception. Come on, double net 20s. We all want this. Uh, there uh, does seem to be an area that's a little extra that where the fog is a little bit more dense than others. Okay. That was not a net about 20. I did not roll double that, I should say. I oh, 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 I, I thought I thought that's what you No, no, I was saying I wanted that. Uh, yeah. that's an eight plus three. Oh, okay, then no. You don't you see you okay. you see you see you the, 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 the snow is is just okay. twirling in front of your eyes. Uh, well then I will not use gust of wind to try and disperse them. I don't think that would work either way. Uh, I'm going it, it, to. I would say that it, I would say that it would. Yeah, I don't know where he is though. This, yeah. Well, yeah. I wouldn't be able to target him. Yeah. Would have been hilarious, but. Um, so I'm going to do conjure elemental. Okay. <laughs> uh, and it's going to be a water elemental. Okay. And since I don't know where the Akriti is, I'm going to put him right on the space where the fire elemental. Is there a range on that? Um, 90 feet. Oh, okay. Yeah, you can do it. Not a problem. Except he is sharing the same space as Ernie at the moment, so he's going to be adjacent to him. 
Okay. Or are they all going to be on the same space? Because um, water elemental can also. I will I, take it. He will take it. <laughs> okay. So the cleric is so done. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Water elemental. It's great. <laughs> I'm probably getting toasted on one side, cooled on the other. The rock grubs are just spinning around. <laughs> <laughs> you're, with, with, no, but when that when that kills the fire on elemental, you're basically going to be blinded by steam and stuff and drowning. Hopefully, <laughs> I'll try and steam these tentacles yes. in the meantime. Maybe that'll yes. help. Steam them out. I tried to, that cooking te- technique on calamari. Oh, today we're going to welcome back to the French gourmet. <laughs> okay, so uh, uh, can you, does your elemental do anything this round, or? Uh, it tells me to roll initiative for it, and it has its own turns. Okay, go ahead right. and put it in. Uh, but does it roll this, does it act this round? Uh, I give it commands, and it sticks around for an hour, and it just listens to what commands I give it. So oh. it, 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 it doesn't get, get to act this turn. Um. <gasps> the water element. No, of- it takes its own initiative. Cool. So uh, okay. it does not turn. Well, on me, Dizel, do you probably know that I can breathe water with my cloak? So that is totally fine. If I, I did I- not actually know that, but this is great. <laughs> yeah. Um, so it's going to have initiative count. Three plus I don't know the dexterity of a water elemental. Yeah, well, that's what that's what the three is. Just go ahead and do a roll plus three. Okay, roll plus three. Yeah, uh, three plus three is six. Okay, he is going to go last. So because he's last, I'd say that he does get to go this round. Okay, sounds good. Um, yeah, I'm gonna pull up the stat page for water elemental so I know what it can do. I, I put the link in the uh, Zoom chat. I see. Thank you. Yeah, and then uh, it will technically be up when you're done. Okay. Um, can I have it do the multi attack slam onto the uh, fire elemental, preferably without hitting Sugarbeard? I'm going to say that he is going to take damage from it. I will say that it's going to be halved from friendly fire, then quartered from the cloak of the manta ray. Is it worth it? Um, yeah, because would it, it takes damage just when it, it is, forms. It, it is essentially encompassing him. Okay. Would the what? Would the fire elemental take damage just from the formation of the water elemental? Uh, it is not. It is not vulnerable to water. Uh, well, well, no, well. If, if you're conjuring it on it, uh, does it say what what size is that? Because if it's more than if it's more than thirty gallons of water, it actually kills the elemental. Um. It doesn't say that its size is large. It's a large elemental. Yeah. And then it has water form. I'm trying to think what the what, what the volume of. Let be ten feet by ten feet, roughly. That's the size of large. So a hundred. So that would be about a hundred square feet. A gallon of water is about. Well, I'd say that's one cubic foot. Hundred square feet, two gallons. Hold on, I have a converter. Well, it's it's not square. It's you would need to convert it to cubic feet, so we would need uh, to know how tall it is. How many gallons of water would you say are in the water? Uh, that uh, so one hundred cubic feet is seven gallons. Yeah. Oh, only seven gallons. Okay. Seven and a half. Uh, okay. I, I think you have your decimal moved over a little bit. Do I? This yeah. is what I found. Um, I just found that on Reddit. Because it's ten by ten. Is volume of a hundred. Well, but it's not taking up that full space. It's part of it is true. Uh, would only fill about a third of that by volume. I mean, I know that a trash can is like one six cubic gallons. foot. One cubic foot is seven gallons. Yeah. Oh, I missed that. Yeah. So that's going to be at two, least uh, two. Let's just say thousand gallons. gallons. Yeah. So for uh, I see two thousand gallons a little bit low below that page. Yeah, but I'm I'm gonna say that if it's if it's if one cubic foot is seven gallons, that's enough to kill the elemental. Success. Then I'll just have it move off sugar here. Oh. Yeah. I'm cool with that. 
I yeah. like the Wilma attack because if I fail on a uh, on a strength save, I take two d eight plus four bludgeoning damage, and then if it's larger, smaller, I'm also grappled. <laughs> I love it. So, yeah, that that yeah that. So the fire elemental puff is gone in a puff of smoke, uh, obscuring the area, uh, effectively making Sugar Beard blind. Um, cool. Does my eye patch help with that? It's it's <laughs> it's natural steam. Got it. So I I don't know. Yeah, I mean. My eye patch just gives me advantage on perception checks that rely on sight. So I don't know. Uh, so then, so then you won't have percent. You won't have advantage. Yeah, that makes sense. I'm just normalized. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, top of the order is Dandelion. Who is is that? Sleep storm concentration. It is concentration up to one minute. Okay. Uh, you can make a perception check to try and determine where the Freedy is, or you can do whatever, but there's no visible threat at the moment. Yeah, I'm going to try to see if I can spot the Afrit. Okay. The nat 20 uh, uh, it's, plus it's a, 4. It's I, don't, I have great wisdom, so it's only a 24. Well, it's disadvantage. Because uh, he's technically that's right. Yeah, he's a, he's heavily obscured. Uh, that's going to be a fourteen. So uh, uh, eighteen. I'll give it to you. Uh, you are able to determine an a, an area of thicker. Yeah. Condensation. Yeah, but I can't I can't see him per se as in targeting him. Um, hmm. Uh, I have to be able to see him. Um, now I'll um, I'll just um, I will hold my action to cast Charm Monster if I if if he comes into clear view. The, okay. So my my action would be cast Charm Monster. The trigger would be him attaining a form such as going back to his fire form okay. uh, or becoming in clear view. So that's that would be the trigger. Okay. And okay. if that doesn't happen, then then I lose my action. Fair enough. Yep. That brings it up to his turn. Uh, he moved ten feet towards you last time. He's going to move another ten feet towards you this time. Uh, he is essentially still within the cloud. Who? Okay. Uh, towards Dandelion. And that is all he is going to do. Uh, rain. No idea what to do now. Now no one's following. Correct. Not even, not even uh, Dandelion, who I thought was going to follow. Uh, I guess I will. No idea what to do. Um, I guess I will go back to stand with Dandelion. And I mean. So oh, I, I, I didn't know you left. left. What's that? Yeah, she used, she, used her, she used her action to bravely run away. Well, <laughs> I didn't know you left. So much to run away as I was trying, hopefully, trying to get everyone else to go, and we just kite this thing for five hundred feet, and then yeah. use it to get rid of the freaking grubs when we get to the location. I mean, I thought the enemy disappeared when the fire elemental disappeared. I don't see anything else. I'm gonna walk, go back to. I'm gonna go back to. Um, I'm gonna go back to Dandelion, I guess. So far, so far, he's the only one that's technically aware that it's even still around. Um, I can't really ready an action because I really I can't. Well, oh, you I mean, you used your you used your action to dash, so you're two movements away from the perimeter. Uh, well, I mean, I know he. Uh, I'm probably two minutes away. All right, you know what? That's what I'll do. I'll make my two actions to come back and stand with Dandelion because that should be about right where he was. Because he was. Uh, about he he moved out too. We he was uh, uh, get, roll a roll a d eight. I mean, we all we all moved thirty feet, and then we all moved. Then I moved double. Yeah, yeah. roll a, both both of you roll a d eight if you oh, don't get, if, 
Yeah, dandelion and, and roll a d8. If you don't match, we'll say that you went the same direction. Eight. Oh, we didn't match, that's for sure. Okay, so then yeah, you're, you, so then yeah, he's not on the other side of the storm. He what? He is on the other side? He, 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 you, you didn't roll an eight, correct? Yeah. Then, then no, he didn't move to the opposite side of the storm. Oh, okay. Yeah. So yeah, you, you, you can stand beside him, that's fine. All right. Uh, sugar beard. Do I look around and see any enemies? Uh, go ahead and give me your perception. Uh, you're not at disadvantage. I am at disadvantage or not? You said you're not. Uh, okay. Uh, that was a 13. No, you don't see anything except for snow. Cool. Then I will um, run out towards Carol. Uh, is, is it, I'm, I'm going to say with, on the ice, give me a dex save okay. of Dandelion's spellcasting ability or your prone. Uh, well, let's see, what do I get? Plus, yeah, I rolled a 10 dex, so oh. I probably fell on my butt. <laughs> yep, you, you, you were prone. Whee-oo! All right, slide. Woo! All right. Uh, uh, I will say you, the edge towards Carol's side at least. So uh, I, I'm, I'm, no, I'm, I'm picturing you like r- like running in place and then just like going ass over tits like like a Charlie uh, Brown. Character. Got it. So no movement. I just I, I, will, I will give you your action to get up. All right. Well, then I will get back up, and I guess I'll be my turn. Yeah. Is that that reasonable? Yeah. That that totally makes sense. Okay. Uh. Dissolve, you're up. Okay. Um, uh, and three, you three. Yeah, you 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 uh, failed your check. I'm not gonna get if you didn't see it the first time. I'm not gonna give you a second check. Has still not appeared. Correct. Okay. Uh, and you but um, you still have your water elemental uh, effectively still engulfing uh, sugar beard. Oh, I thought I moved him off last turn. Um, I'll have the water. He can breathe in water, so it doesn't matter. It's like a suit of armor. Um, I'm gonna move. I'm gonna move it off of him, though. <laughs> okay. Feel bad. Um, now, now is commanding it your action? Um, I think that's a bonus action. I thought so too. Conjure elemental as a druid. It doesn't actually say. Uh, roll initiative for the element which has some. It obeys any verbal command that you issue. No action required. Okay. Interesting. Um, I'll have it. Uh, I'll have it. Um, probably just move off Sugar Beard. Okay. And then hold an action in case the Afridi reappears. Okay. Uh, within melee range of it. Okay. Okay. That's that's fair. Uh, And it's going to, uh, since it wasn't commanded to do anything else, it's not going to do anything else. And that brings us to Dandelion. Oh shit! If you lose concentration of the water, yeah, it it can it can go it can go rogue. Uh, Dandelion's also muted. I can't lose concentration from damage though because of my hit subclass. Okay, so I will um, basically do the same thing. Uh, I'll um, see that um, I'll see that uh, our healer has rejoined us and saying, "Hey, I think, I think, I think I got this." Think, are, 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 are you are you like guiding guiding her her eye line? Yeah, I'm like I think I know where it is. I think I know where it is. Once it pops out of there, I'm gonna charm it and make it give me three wishes. I like this plan. Um, sure. So okay. I'm basically waiting for it to pop out of here of the sleek cloud and cast charm monster on it because I'm going to charm it. And I will. Make it I will uh, holding an action takes up your bonus action. I will let you inform Rain of where it is, or I will let you hold an action. Uh, 
Um, I'll, I'll, I'll inform Rain of where it is. So you're not holding. You're not. Yeah, I, I'm. I'm not going to hold the action. I'll, okay. I'll, uh, I'll uh, take the attack if, if, if an attack comes because okay. I'm brave. Okay. I've been inspired by Captain Sugar Beets. <laughs> but that that makes sense, though, right? Yeah. No, no, okay. it does. It does. I it does. I can't do something. Okay. Well, uh, right about then is when it would have gotten it to its 30 foot range and it pops out. Uh, and does get is gaseous form at will drop or does it take an action to? If it's a crate, it should be at will. Gaseous form. There it is. Blah, blah, da, 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 da. I only see. Yeah, I don't. I don't. As if the creature drops to zero hit points. Yeah, I, I, I think he might. Oh no, it is. It's concentration. He'll drop concentration. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, he's he's going to drop concentration at will and pop out and. Uh, he's essentially right on top of both of you. Of Dizelle and Dandelion. Yeah, Rain and Dandelion. Yeah. Well, I thought. I thought. She was well, she moved to the end of the difficult terrain because she was heading towards the grave. And then I, we, 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 we rolled to determine which side of the storm they were both on when they when she ran. Oh, okay. And then and I'm still in the middle that's what that was for, I think. That's what that was for. Yeah. I, 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 honestly, I thought we both ran in the same direction anyways, because that was his idea. Was, well, was, well, you didn't all run in the same direction because Sugarbeard ran right into the middle of it. Yeah, I'm, I'm 30 that, feet away that, from Dandelion and Carol. I thought Dandelion ran in the same direction because we were both, because I thought that was the general idea. Or yeah, that, yeah. We, we, we rolled for it, you guys, it, you ended up yeah, doing that anyway. Oh, yeah, it, it ended up working. Um, so he is going to hurl flame at rain and make a scimitar attack against uh, Dandelion. Oh boy. Okay, it's going to be a disadvantage because I have my cloak of displacement. Okay. Uh, hurl away. Uh, that's a uh, plus 10. Does a 19, uh, Dandelion? Nine, yes, it does. A 19 will hit me. Okay, because I rolled a 9 and a 10, and I get a plus 10. Now hit me. And then 21 for the flame against rain. Yep. Oh, yeah. So you're going to take 5d6 rain. That's 6, 7, 9, 13 fire damage. That's and not great rolls for you. No, and the scimitar attack is great just roll. is just 9. What the hell did it just do? Oh, I had the temporary hit points. Thank you very much. Yep. So... <laughs> How'd that happen? That's its turn. Okay. Uh, that brings us to rain. Uh, to rain, yeah. Oh, God. Uh, well, oh, he wasn't. That's right. He couldn't hold action. Well, shoot. Uh, well, now I can try it. I will try to cast Bane on that effer. Okay. Uh, make a charisma save, TC 17. <laughs> Roll back. Do, 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 do. Charisma, charisma. Oh man, three, uh, eighteen. You rolled an eight. Eighteen. I, I rolled a. I rolled a fifteen, and I get plus oh, three. Oh damn you! Or, well, no. If it's a save, I get plus seven. So that's. That's a lot more than seventeen. Yeah, that's twenty-two. That is disappointing. Oh. All right. Um. That's oh, yeah, about. It's a that's about all I can do right now, I think. Okay. All right, Dissolve. Um, I'd like to command the water elemental to okay. do a oh, attack on them. To do a what? Uh, the two slam attacks onto the three D. Okay, it is moving through difficult terrain to get there because it's essentially 30 feet away. What's the movement on the water elemental? It's only 30 feet. I don't think it's going to make it. Uh, it oh, it, it has a movement of 30 feet? Yeah. 
But if it's difficult terrain, it'll do 15. I, I'm trying to fi- I'm trying to figure it out because uh, it is water and it's ice. Oh, it, it's in the storm though, isn't it? Or on the edge? That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. It's it's in an ice storm, but it's water. Okay, so it'd be 20 feet. Movement's 20 feet. Okay. So the, what's, the freeze what's, ability. What's the range on the slam? Slam's only five feet. Okay, so it's not going to be able to, but you're going to move, command it to move towards the Afrit? Uh, yeah. Okay. And uh, it doesn't, you don't have to uh, use your action to command it, we determined. So what else, What would you like to do for your turn? Uh, since I, I can cast without dropping concentration if it's not a concentration spell, right? Uh, you, it is a concentration to control elemental. Yeah, but I can cast another spell that's not concentration in the interim, right? Correct. Okay, I will hold a dimension door to just kind of move myself back if the Afridi comes into melee, or if the Afridi comes into melee range, yeah. Okay. Uh, You will lose a spell slot if you don't use that by the next turn. Okay, if I don't use it, can I use it then? Wait, do you have dimension door? I do. Shit, you could take us right to the gravesite. It has a range of 500 feet. He could take one of you. Why? I don't know if the gravesite's there. Oh. You would have heard it described to you. You would have to, uh, if you give me an intelligence check, I will let you figure out, or uh, what did I make? Was it survival, Carol, that I made you roll? Yeah. That's right. Yeah, yeah give, give me a survival, give me a survival roll to determine how far away you are. Okay, that's not great. That's 10 plus two for 12. I'm going to say that you aren't you you're thinking anywhere between 200 and 1500 feet okay so i know it's in roughly that area i I, i'll give you that i'll give you that far of a range okay um then i'll just hold the action if the afridi approaches to uh dimension door 500 feet forward otherwise i'll just uh, uh yeah otherwise i'll just burn the spell slot Okay. Fine. Uh, you could, if, if you don't want to waste it and you want to progress things, I'm not telling you how to how to how to play it, but you could trigger that to go off at the at the start of the Afridi's turn, so that you don't waste it and you're still closer to your goal. Okay. Yeah, I can do that. I'll try that. Uh, I just putting that out there. That's yeah. Okay, uh, that brings us to Dandelion. You're muted. Yeah, I can see it. I'm going to try to charm it, casting Charm Monster. It needs to make a DC 16 save. Uh, against what? Wisdom. Wisdom. Oh. 19 plus. I actually, I actually wanted to fail that. Oh, that was a it's a 21. You get ah. it. Damn Rap. it. Damn. Basically, this thing needs to get like some dexterity attacks against it. Ah. I, I really wanted to fail that. God damn, that would have been cool. You know, uh-huh. he's a gem. You could have just died. <laughs> well, once I have it charmed, there's all sorts of stuff I can do to it. You know, yeah. I can. That's the thing is that you know I have to get it under my thrall. Maybe um, we can try. Okay. We want all right. To be- all right, I'm going to, uh, as a bonus action, begin singing um, Bardic Inspiration to, uh, to um, uh, Rain. To me? You have an inspiration die, yes. Oh, You're next boy. to me. You, you came Is back. Right? Yeah, I'm just falling around a lot. Uh, seeing, seeing none of you as direct imminent threats, it's going to look around, it's going to cast Plane Shift, and it's going to return to the Elemental Plane. Oh, left. Yeah. Yay. This is okay. Yeah, that's that's fine. And that's let's, fine. Let's, I did that thing. I just disappear because of Dimension it's Door. It's not. Yeah, it's not. It's not trying to stick around and fuck with you guys. It was. It just went it out of the bottle. You let it out of the bottle. It's safe. It's back in the elemental plane. Hey, Blake. Yes. So I realized I get hit by fire. Did that do anything? Further, you got hit by fire. Oh yeah. Uh, first one, you felt discomfort. The second one, you would have taken more damage as they burrowed in you. Okay, so it only uh, just uh, 
hurt a little more. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll I'll give you the same uh, same description that I gave to uh, Sugar. All right, cool. So I'm okay. Yeah. Let's go. Let's get the F there, and then we. You got one out. more. Uh, one more. Uh, oh God. Four times your rock rubs, and then you'll be there. Four times so rock rubs. Four for this last one. This is for the last final sprint. Okay, that's not too awful. <laughs> hey guys, I got some bad news. What? Yeah, the water elemental's going rogue. Oh, you lost concentration? Takes no, I lost seven. consciousness. No, you're dead. I have four on me with four, that's 16 straight to zero. So yeah, if then you're dead, zero so you're straight dead. There, you die with the rock. Oh, grub. you're not dead. It doesn't work like that. No, if you have rock grubs, you're dead. If you have rock yeah, grubs, rock, you're rock dead. Rock grubs kill you instantly at zero. All right, all right, all right, all right. Well, um, if could someone take? All right, could someone now take them? And I can cast revivify. I'm Wait, saying, I'm gonna have, have enough level. I have a 300 GP diamond somewhere. Uh, in my they will. I, I will say that sensing that there's no more energy life life to be sucked out of this person. If someone wants to go approach him now, a hug would be sufficient. I'll go hug the dead body. No, no, let let um let Dandelion do it because remember he's being regenerated. Oh. Oh well, I already remember did. It. The, you're gonna do it. I mean, yeah, I'm gonna got, do it. I know you've got health to spare, and then I'll cast revivify. My most my most poignant sonnet will be for Desult and for for Captain Captain Stony Beard. Uh, also, be, be, I think we've called him every uh, single name except his actual one. Um, <laughs> before you revivify, though, I, yeah. I, uh, I slice off an ear of Desult. Why are you doing that? <laughs> Because I've like, never tasted whatever. I don't let you do that. That is. I think he. I think he's. I think he's dragonborn. I think he's dragonborn. I am. Yeah. Chicken. Ooh. Yeah. I've never had dragonborn. <laughs> no. I, don't I, don't stop in here. That's not right. Um. I. I took the ear. You're in my supposed mouth. to be a I goth. You're supposed to be probably you. absolutely oh, okay with you this, man. Without an ear. <laughs> What level is I'll, 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 I'll allow it. If you if you if you're only going to cast for vivify on him, if you're only going to waste for vivify, yeah, I'll, I'll allow him to come back without a mirror. Vivify is oh, yeah. level, so I have to use his fourth level slot to do it. Okay. Uh, you got your diamond. Yeah, I mean, I didn't go through a lot of at, at, at twelfth level. I'll say that you're smart enough to carry yeah, around that's a, what I was a, say. a revivify, 12, a revivify, revivify diamond. Yeah. Right well, I would have had a diamond. Yeah. Or two or more. I'm twelfth freaking level. I was gonna I say at, at least at least sufficient us... for at least sufficient for revivify. I'll Wait, say you how have many a... you, did you actually say how much gold we got? Because I only remember the items. No, no, no. You were just getting paid double. No, I mean how much money we would have had to start with. But that's oh, fine. It would have been I was gonna say you're you you've been adventuring long enough that you have yep. all, all of the gold. That's what I would assume. So that's why I figured I probably would have them, even if I didn't <laughs> didn't throw them on my inventory. I probably didn't eat them. Diamonds aren't tasty. Can't really eat them. You'll break your teeth anyway. I know. That's why I didn't eat the rock genasi either, or the earth genasi, because it was just rocks and crystals and stuff. Oh, and then it, on was, top it, was, of that, it was a deer. That, okay. That's why I thought I was going to eat it. They would have killed all of you. All right, I'm keeping that one in my Totally, pocket. totally. Oh, I'm going to use the staff. I don't know. Is anyone else? Does everyone need healing again? No, I'm fine. All I'm right. okay. Um, so, so you have all of them now, Dandelion. Yes, I have all of them. Okay, so you took four from the corpse. Wait, I thought I got the four from Dizelle because I went up and cut off his ear and, and hugged him. Uh, are you guys going to fight over him? No, I, I got them. They're mine. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, did he's so brave? Did, did, so okay. so brave. And, and, and in just in just in awe and uh, admiration of him, you you don't even contest it. That's fine. Well, no, it's just. I mean, yeah, I he's he is my hero. Okay. No, he's that, my, that, he's that, my that's hero. Fine. That's fine. Just making making it clear. Add four more to your number. And we brought him back successfully with Revivify. I live again. Why can't I hear? 
Captain Captain Cinnamon Sugar. You can you can hear it's just now you need everyone to speak into this ear. Where'd my ear go? The the uh, the uh, rod grubs got it. They oh, that's rubbed it away. Thank you, cleric, for bringing me back. You're Thank welcome. You. Uh, uh, I assume we need uh, actually some healing, healing too. That would be appreciated. You are within visible range of the grave site. All right, let's just go. Yeah, it, let's it just be going. I have to a, all do it. We're gonna all it is a full die. cemetery. Uh, there's you about four, there's a, probably four or five recently dug graves. Are there headstones? Not yet. Is there a grave keeper or something? Uh, perception check. Uh, plus four. 16. Uh, yeah, actually, there does there does seem to be a uh, kind of actually looks like a, an individual that kind of looks like Rain uh, uh, walking around. I point out that person to the rest of the group and let them know that maybe they know where the grave's at. I'll approach him. Okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll walk up there with Rain. Good day. I'll hang back with my one hit point. <laughs> I think she I'm going to okay. start singing, singing the praises of Captain Cinnamon Sugar. Cinnamon Toast Crunch. <laughs> Captain Crunch. Uh, okay, uh, this this individual, it's a male, greets you. Uh... So no, no there's, every day is a good day. I shake his hand. Yeah, it's a. <laughs> he shakes your hand back. Do any rot grubs leave my body to his? You're too healthy. I mean, I've been beaten up a lot. You're still too healthy. Yep, too healthy. All right. It was worth a try. So I will say, I will ask him, like, so we're looking uh, for a grave of a recently deceased to finish. Point, point, points, points around to the uh, aforementioned uh, fresh graves. Well, no, I, I understand that, but we need one particular one because we are fulfilling her last wish. And I'll name? state the name. I don't, uh, player forgets the name. The, the, the character would remember the name. Little girl uh, named Pulbert something. You didn't know, you didn't find out her name, but you knew it would probably be a snorg. It's also, well, we know her last name because- That's, that's, why, that's, what, I, that's why I said- Yeah. You, yeah. Oh, so I'll, say, state, I'll state the last name. Uh, I personally suck at remembering names. Thanks, thanks for a second. Uh, Points uh, points you over to one specific leads you over specifically to one, and is going to kind of hang back and watch you. I stick my hands down. Is he? The... He is Kellenvor, right? No. Oh, it's not. Can I make a religion check to know what he is. Which is he a cleric or no? Or just... uh, yeah, different uh, different diocese. Yeah. Okay, fair. Well, I don't want to disrespect him by saying Kellen Van Kellen Vor, you know, He's just he's he's going to he's going to stand watch, and if you try to bring anyone back, he's going to stop you. Oh, I wouldn't want to do that. That's 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 the important thing to take away from that. All right. So we'll go over now. It's like, how do we get these things out of us? Uh, hmm. Maybe they'll recognize her. Nature. I was going to say, who, who made that save earlier? Or who made that check earlier? Dandelion? Yeah. Put my hand Dandelion during the hug. Right, Dan, I, I, I just kind of did that during the hug. And um, I'm, I'm going to say um, um, we, we probably need to find some way to, to get these things out of us. We, we, we know they don't like fire. Um, we have to give them something more attractive to uh to go into so um um Dezel, why don't you like lay down on the ground and we'll like like cover you up full of like the 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 dirt up to your neck and maybe they'll recognize their master and go and go down there so we're gonna like dig like a little grave 
right? And we're going to put Bezel in the grave. Okay. Well, well, I'm sorry, well, real quick. Did, did I get healed because I never got the answer on that? I think you're still at one hit point. Yeah, well, we're, 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 he's, the, he's the least healed person, so he's the least. And, and Well, no, there's there's no buggies in you, are there? Right. Right. <sighs> And okay, my bad. Are, are Sorry. You, are you all standing around this grave? Where are you in relation to? I, I put my hands into the fresh earth. Oh, you okay? Actually, you yeah. know what? You know what? You are going to take six more damage per grub as they all leave your body, trying to burrow back into their master. Yay! Oh, I, that, yeah. That's not going. That's not going to knock you down. That's not going to kill you if it turns you into zero because they're moving out of you, though. Yeah, that that's fine. I figured they had ten feet blind sight, so I just need to be close to their master. Yeah, they, they are. They are going to be able to sense her. Okay. I'm gonna do the same thing. Okay. I, every y'all take six per grub as they as they rip themselves. Six times four. Six times four. Three is eighteen. That should be. That's okay for me. Seven. Yeah, that 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 hurt a little bit, but I'm but I'm all right. Yeah, yeah. You're, 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 you've still got regenerate up. Yeah, brave keepers, but... brave, brave keepers going over there, going that sure looks weird. <laughs> you have to kill them. That's great. You succeeded. I'll be happy now for a change. <laughs> Okay. Uh, yeah, and, and with and with and with that, yes, effectively you have uh, been successful. They were all uh, protected more or less. Uh, only killed one of you once. <laughs> uh, all that's left to do is go back and uh, tell Humbert that you were successful. Uh, you get the impression that somehow the gravekeeper is going to make sure that he is aware that you were. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So if you, had tried to, if you had tried to do anything hinky here, he was also going to snitch on you. Uh, uh, but other than that, mission accomplished. Now you just got to get back through the uh, cops of trees that you're not supposed to go through. Yeah, and try something. Well, like can't we me. just go? Is there any way around it? Oh, yeah, there's there's woods all the way around it. Then I'll just stick to the woods. I was going to say, I'm like, it's, it should be easy enough getting back unless you encounter anything. But that's not for this adventure. This part of the adventure was successful. Good job, guys. All right. Yeah. Even though I tried to kill myself a couple times, a couple yeah, times, I, I, and I, damn it, I wouldn't let you. I, I wish, I, I wish you would have gotten me a free. All right, uh, I was, was going to try to charm that a free. I really did want to have him be my. I my would, I would have been favorite. curious what, he, what, what. Oh uh, yeah, I would have been curious what you would have wished for. But uh, f let's do final thoughts, everyone. Uh, we'll start with Scott. Uh, yeah. Um, no, I, uh, I really liked it. It was nice and, uh, um, clean. Uh, I liked it. it was a clean objective and the, uh, the, the grubs gave a nice impetus for us to keep moving along and not to dilly and dally and, and tarry around too much. Uh, I was scared about the druids. Um, I, I, I didn't think I, we I, 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 let the, I let the cat out of the bag. I shouldn't have let it slip. I should have let you keep going. Yeah, and, and and you know it, awesome. that that probably would have ended us pretty bad, but uh, but uh, you know still that was uh, that that was nice. It was uh, it was a nice. It was uh, it, I liked it. I liked it a lot. All right, uh, Matt. Final thoughts. Uh, I don't get to play as a player a lot. Usually, I'm behind the screen, so this has been a unique experience. Um, <laughs> Anytime you want to take over, let let, let uh, Frank know. I'm sure. <laughs> I'll keep that in mind when I have some. Well, I have some time this uh, January. Um, but yeah, this was a lot of fun. Uh, what was it? The the rock grot you said. The rock grubs. Rock grubs. Okay. It was really. Grubs. It was pretty unique. It's not something I've seen used before. Um, so yeah, it was pretty fun. Yeah. Uh, Ernie. Uh, I thought that was pretty cool. Um. I was hoping that there would be a chance to to show off my cannibalism, um, since that is <laughs> my character. You were you were able to sneak one in. I, uh, <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah, I, I'll eat literally anything. Uh, I'll taste it. So I, I had fun um, with that one. I, I may actually take this character and make it a more of a campaign character eventually. I was. I was <laughs> no, we, we'll we'll have to have Sancho Panza here following you around. Yeah. <laughs> All righty, and finally, Carol, final thoughts? Oh, God, that was a lot of fun. Um, 
geez, I don't know. Uh, it was, yeah, it was just fun. Uh, and uh, I realized how much I'd forgotten or probably was only half paying attention since I was busy working on my own, uh, you know, on my own. Yeah, and, you, and you know what? I couldn't tell you, I couldn't tell you what yours was now that I'm trying to think of it. So yeah. I, I, I'm sorry I was giving you shit mine for was, never I, mine was the rip on the, uh, on the, uh, I originally started with the uh, the leg lamp from Christmas Story. Video. Oh, that's right. Holy relic. That's right. I just and you know I saw of course the movie was on and I realized they buried it in the backyard by the garage. I'm like, oh my god, no, that totally works. Um, so but yeah, this was great uh, and good job to all the players. That was that was. That was, I wasn't sure how it was going to go. I did remember about the free and the fire elemental at the end. And I remember we originally, I thought we were supposed to actually use them to get the things, to kill the things out of us. But I like the, uh, the extra. No, that, that was the, 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 the roles I had were you had to escort a volatile pet from a temple to a cemetery. Right. Uh, there were, there was a plant encounter, a seven druids. I remember the druids. I remember the druids. Uh, there, there was, there was <laughs> mutiny. There was, there was a mutiny. That was, that was him stealing the bottle from Dandelion. Uh, oh. And the, the point of that was supposed to be to have the Afrit kill all, heat you up sufficiently to kill the grubs. Oh, so he was trying to stop us from getting there. Correct. Ted Peak to pick the weakest character. I kept thinking it was a bad idea for us to let him keep carrying the uh, hit the grubs because I realized that they, you know, made. Yeah, yeah. Better. After I said the D, after I said D eight, I'm just like, oh shit, no, no. Half, 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 <laughs> yeah, half. you would have like. I think yeah. No, that that, was we really would have been dead pretty quick. Role, it's like you just did like over, you know, you did like two thirds of my health. I think in that first one. So, well, yeah, I'm like, when I, I, was rolling, I was rolling fours and sixes all night, and I'm like, oh, shit, yeah, okay. Are we still it, you know what, That's, that was the, but this is something you're kind of making up, so, you know. And yeah, yeah, the whole, the, whole point of, the whole point of this one was that it took, it was supposed to take literally 15 minutes of prep. So, I hope nah, that it shows, I, can the, see I, that, I hope that it shows the amount of effort that I put into it. <laughs> Well, no, yeah, you did you did really well putting it together. It's just that there's certain things that I think you can figure out when you actually do them. Like yeah, whether or yeah. not your damage you have planned was too much. Yeah, it, and, it just goes to show changing just, shit on the fly is always uh always a yeah, viable option. Always. Exactly. I think it was great you're just on the fly. I do not think it was a mistake for you to actually clue us in about the druids when it was that deadly. Um, yeah, you really were. They, totally they were. They would have actually given you all regenerate and uh, and and uh, transport via plants, and they would have they would have knocked that last leg off of your trip. I really wish I had the regeneration. I was like really bummed out, but yeah. that's why I was like I, I did. I was happy I was able to you know help salvage that. Yeah. Maybe. I was really happy that. Although my God, if, if you if you hadn't God. healed him, I don't. If you hadn't healed him, I don't think Dandelion would have been able to convince him. God. Yeah, I don't know. I I didn't roll very good on that, and I didn't pick a good path to go. I was still too stuck up on the heroic aspect and not the you know the uh, reverent aspect of the force. It was more yeah, we were heroes instead of this is their reverent sacred force. But Scott, I was wondering why you were singing the praises of the guy who just tried to kill one of them. That, that, that's, that's, that's why he rolled. That's, that's why he rolled at disadvantage. Right. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> no, no, that, that's why. Is that? See, see, the thing is, is, and, and I and I agree with y'all. The the thing is, is that I, I don't like to make a persuasion check or a performance check, just thinking that the player is going to just automatically, you know, know exactly what to do. Right. It's that, you know, you, you still need to state I'm going to do this. And then your performance check is how successful you are and what you're trying to accomplish. If I'm trying to accomplish the idea that Captain 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 Sugarbutt is the greatest thing of all time, then if they hate Sugarbutt, then it doesn't matter. I'm just successful in pissing them off even more. Correct. Right? Yeah. And that's what happened. And I'm like, yeah. going after I set it up for you. 
Yeah. And, and, and the thing is, is that is that I couldn't get out of the idea that, oh, these guys are mad at this thing. I need to get out of this. We're the we're the conquering massive heroes and instead change act to we are to be reverent of the forest. Right. 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 Those are two different persuasion. I, I don't acts. I don't want to cut you guys short. But oh, yeah, sorry. This, sounds, this sounds like an excellent uh uh, thread to pick up on Tuesday. I'm sure everyone else wants yeah. to uh, uh, go to bed for the evening. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, uh, sorry, again, sorry. No, 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 no apologies. But again, as always, follow us on Twitch, follow us on Twitter. We got new people sometimes. If you want to be a new person hey. when, when you don't have to deal with me, uh, hit us up. Uh, other than that, uh, say good night, everyone. Good night. Good night, good night everyone. Happy New Year, everyone. Happy New Year.